So what time are we at? 15 and a half hours. Okay. Solid. <laughs> Good morning. Good news. I bought some liquid metal. It's not quite warm enough. Yeah, gallium. <laughs> Drink it? Tempting. <clears throat> not it's not uh not wet through? enough. Why is po cuphead so small? Do, 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 do. This is the smallest cuphead we've seen. You. Uh probably no, this one. Yeah, there we go. What did I just join in on? Walkies. Plink. All right, so let me get this thing set up here, and then we have to get back to six a.m. on. Uh, uh, you know what I'm saying? Post gaming. Seven months with Spiff Arena, Poggers. What are you gotta do? I only have the final part of night six left. However, to just push it right at the end, uh, we decided that I have to do expert devil. Yo, so that's really been the, the kicker. We, I should say, I just decided because funny. Uh, so we're like right at the cusp of finishing here. Almost two Twitch babies. I have well, six post shift stars. Good luck today. Whatever that means. Um. What did I just join in on? Walkies. I haven't even watched the post shift Hello, two vid yet. Sig. Oh, I didn't make one. There is no post shift two vid. Thanks for that nine months polish. Lovely Ashy. Thanks for seventeen. Nipple Nick. Thanks for five. Uh, Malmul, thanks for seven months. Otherwise, dear, thanks for six months. Unibee, thanks for 27 months. Officer Depot, thanks for nine months. Did I just join in on? It's big. What am I looking at? You clearly this haven't been here for the last couple days. Which one? The one on the right or the one beneath me? What did I just join in on? <laughs> spig head post cup shit happy 12 months. Spiggy roo, spig loaf, shake, spig loaf, shake, so spig loaf. For shake. all those, just, just, just Why? getting in. Whoa, Spig, how is Loaf and Page? Getting getting in this bazank for the first time. What? You okay, video game? Oh, that's why. Beep. Um, what we're doing, this is day five of this, I believe, and it'll be the last day, presumably. Uh, what we're doing is... Ah. I may have totally screwed it. Well, maybe not. Hold on. What we're doing is playing both games at once to prove that post shift is easy. Because it's not that bad. Um, I chose Cuphead because I can play it with one hand. And because it's actually hard. Um, I've never played Cuphead before. But I've now beaten the game. And we're now doing the devil on Expert. For the final part of post shift, post shift Hi, night six is divided into three checkpoints. We're on the last checkpoint of night six, and on the devil. Uh, just currently, my program that allows me to play both games at twice is frozen, so just gonna have to give it a minute. Ha 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 ha. So, you know, just hang out with me. First year subbing here. OR 11 months consecutively. Thanks to the 12 months consecutively. 
Shakes, yeah. Big loaf shakes, big loaf shakes, big thanks, loaf Thanks, Agnes. Shakes. Thank you very much. What did I just join in on? Sleeping, yeah. thanks for 16 months. Ferret, thanks for eight months. Technical difficulties? Hey, it's not a, it's not a sploif stream without technical difficulties. I swim in the technical difficulties. Oh, Vanessa. Okay, it crashed, so let me just reopen it again. Uh, I will once again, to start the day, show off my control scheme, the which has almost been here for a year. is a Two funny months, time. My friend. Also, I was trying to watch your new banger. Hey, Spigo. Welcome back to 2024 TikTok Sim. I think Cuphead might be suffering here. That's gonna crash that. Okay, hold on. <laughs> Gritty Goose, what if haha you gave the gallium a little lick? Haha, -ha, just kidding. And left? Yeah, I know, right? That's how I feel. So, uh, oh. gallium right here. This is a metal with a melting point of 29 degrees Celsius. Which is real fun, because it's not that hard to get something to 29 degrees Celsius. That's like above room temperature by like 6 on? degrees, yeah. roughly, give or take. A couple degrees. Um, and so yesterday even, uh, I went just like to see my parents for something, and uh, I was just holding it while I was driving, and I got it, I got a good chunk of it to melt, it was fun. I just kind of played around with it. I haven't taken it out of the vial at all yet, though. But I have a heater, and I might put it in front of the heater. Why do I have that? Because we were talking about if you could buy Mercury uh, when we were playing Sisyphus, and I apparently you can't, but you can buy Gallium. <laughs> okay, are we all good here? Now we should be all good here. Bingo, we're good. <clears throat> Don't drip it on your carpet. The nice thing is like it would solidify really quick, so I don't think it'll be that hard to like not, I don't know. Lose? What is this about gallium? We got some right here, baby. <laughs> I actually have two vials. They sent me two vials. And a periodic table so I could find what it is. Uh, first thing we're going to be doing is playing post shift without Cuphead up to 6 a.m. We I need to... Uh... We need to catch up. Ah, uh, yes. My control scheme. So I Normally, will show you work the night shift. how I Just play post shift. Going to do light stuff. Good luck to ya. I'm playing post shift with just my mouse. Keep wow, that in mind. Here, it only seems like here are my inputs. Ago, I got gifted that sub. We have W A S D and E on just god awful places on my mouse. Um, I also press Q. Pregnant man. On pregnant man. Pregnant man. Pregnant this man. This keyboard. Pregnant man. That only has Q and R on it. That's where we're at. Uh, and then I'm playing Cuphead with the numpad on my keyboard. <laughs> yeah. So that's where we're at. Who sent you it? The Gallium? Bro, I purchased this on my own. We're not gonna start the time. I guess we could, I don't know. This is like not time spent on the challenge though. For the most part I have been. Yeah, we're dead, we died to... Nonsense, unless. Um. Yeah, screw it, let's run it. This is part of the timer. Even though this is an actual post head. We've been running the timer just constantly. I can't right click. Which button starts my timer? There we go. So with post shift night six, 
it's one of the easier nights, I'd say. Um, the main thing is, right at the start, Foxy arrives. And if somebody arrives as soon as you go to deal with Foxy, you just lose, and that's that. I bought the Gallium on Amazon. <laughs> Buy tin and lithium so you can mix them with the gallium, broski. But why? Why though? Because I've always wanted to hold liquid metal. Yeah, I actually bought it. Why is the night six easier? I'd say it has less RNG, with the exception of the first Foxy. I don't actually think it's that bad. We were actually able to one-shot it when I accidentally closed the game. Once you know what you're doing. So the big question right now is if somebody will come right now. We'll lose. We lose if they do. Uh, yeah, that's it. You have for destruction if you do not leave. My bad. Night 4 isn't very RNG. That's true. I had a hard time with Night 4 just because of the B-Boss, actually, so I'm a bit biased in that way. That B-Boss kind of kicked my ass. It melts at a lower temperature if you mix it. Oh. Yeah, the last phase did eat me alive, yeah. But, I mean, now we're on Devil Nightmare, so that's... Something. King Dice, like... I'd say King Dice was the easiest boss to have a lot of success with once you're good at it. I think... Like, you know, it's a lot of learning, but then once you've learned it, it's the easiest. Whereas with the Devil, I've learned all the Devil stuff, but I'm still getting my ass whooped. <clears throat> One year. Still made in less. Kinda. How is everyone doing? I'm doing good, just chilling with my, uh, just chilling with my Gallium. Who would I challenge to do this run? Uh, I'd love to see how fast Chicken Ninja could do it. Because he's good at Cuphead, so he wouldn't have to learn the game. Like I did. Though there is the weirdness of the controls. That he'd have to deal with. Yeah, setting it up is absolutely a nightmare. Yeah. Whoops, wrong button. Well, it does sound like something Chicken Ninja would do, because he's done stuff with Post Shift and Cuphead. There's a decent chance that he doesn't want to touch Post Shift again, but... Who knows? When Solemn Tempest speedrun? Like, again? Or did you miss a certain week of my... Two weeks of my life. He also played... I don't know what GEO mode for Cuphead is, but I know he was really good at Cuphead. Psalm Tempest is the mountain. The peak. Yeah, I'm planning to do more inscription after this. Hopefully this doesn't take longer than a couple hours. But, like, I am not guaranteeing anything. Okay, hold on. We might die here. I actually gotta go quick pretty fast. Oh, never mind. No, Foxy's gone. We're good. Um, Damn 20 months is a long time. What was I gonna say? I lost my train of thought. Let's get on camp 5. So, this phase, 2 to 4 a.m., is, I think, perhaps the most consistent. Things kind of happen in an order, give or take a couple elements. Uh, we hope to get early baby. We need decent RNG on Balloon Boy. Early baby, and then Ballora probably before Puppet kills, or, like, attacks me. And then it's like... The underneath the chair balloon boy plus the dude on the cams, yada yada. Anyway, we'll see what happens.
Okay. Please. Oh, hold on. I gotta press Q here. Okay. Okay. Check the cam. Nice. Got that guy out of the way. I don't know why I'm blinking. I hope it's because of you. Okay, and then Purple Freddy is somewhere. There he is. Okay, we should actually just survive now to 4 a.m. I won't make it to 6 a.m. though, because I'm going to run out of power. But, uh, yeah. It should be easy clap here. There we go. So we'll die now, but we have a checkpoint. And we're almost to, uh... So yeah, Night 6 isn't that bad once once you kind of know the pattern of it. What? Oh, that's Bonnie! Dude, I don't even know what to do if Bonnie shows up here. I've always just not had him even show up. That's funny. We're dead anyway. I have... Uh -huh. Send the drone. just run out of power. It actually takes a bit to die if you run out of power, so let's just die normally. I'll just be holding this while we go. Uh, so that it warms up. This challenge feels like something I would come up with, but I am here for it, lol. Don't expose me like that. Don't let them know that I've been AI the entire time. Yay. Yeah, I don't actually know. Like, I don't understand 4 a.m. to 6 a.m. very well at all. But con considering it's... Oh, crap. We got the power out as we die. That's unfortunate. Considering it's just two hours... Like, I just do it a couple times, and then win. Yeah, I died to power at the same time that I got jump scared. So now we gotta wait for this slow-ass animation. Kill me! Kill me! Please! If you die, you eat the gallium. No! Yeah, 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 yeah. You are much like no, myself. checkpoints reset to 100% power. I I wouldn't be able to beat the knight without checkpoints because I'd run out of power. I don't. You can get power back, but it's just unnecessary. So I never bothered to figure out how. You like go to the communications and download something or something, but. Meh. Do not eat gallium. It's poisonous when consumed, but not when you touch it. Really? I thought eating metal was a great idea. Chat, please. I'm marginally smarter than that. <laughs> what did I just join in on? Walkies. Don't listen to them, Spiff. Eat the gallium. It would stay liquid in my body because my body is warm, so it would be no problem. I'd just poo it out, chat. Easy clap. Please don't kill me. <laughs> it's a great source of iron. It's not iron, it's gallium. <laughs>
Did I see the Canada versus Venezuela game? I don't even know which sport you're talking about, so no. Is that like soccer? Probably. If it gets if it's against Venezuela. Hello, Spiff. I have a 13-hour car ride tomorrow. Do I marathon all of your marathons? Uh, put together, I don't think they're 13 hours, so you'll have to add in, like... Solemn Tempest or something. If metal is not supposed to be eaten, why does it look so tasty, SMH? Gotcha, Chica. Well, I don't think this will be easy. It's... Uh, six a past 6 a.m. won't be easy. No, it'll be a little while, but I don't even know how this mechanic works, and I should be able to beat it in a couple tries. So this night goes to 6 a.m., and then 200 seconds afterwards, so... What we have to do still is the 200 seconds afterwards. If Bonnie shows up here, we lose, because I don't know how to deal with him. He just doesn't really show up. I'm so confused. Why does Spiff have Gallium? Because it's fun. I don't know. We were talking about Mercury the other day, and so I bought some Gallium. I want to touch the metal. Ah, oh, crap. Did we get Chica? No? Okay. No! Unstable. Don't kill me, Chico! <laughs> God damn it. I think a piece of uranium would be next. I don't think you can buy uranium on Amazon, unfortunately. Unless you can. You can? Oh, shit. <laughs> well, that's interesting. <laughs> Hmm. A lot of calories in uranium. No. Yeah. What am I not? Or why are you not playing Cuphead? Because we've already done. We've already beaten four to six a.m. with Cuphead. We only have to do the last section of night six. So I'm just getting to it. The hardest part about 9-6 was 12 to 4 a.m. If you were there for like the four hours it took us, you would know. I did kind of skip 4 to 6, but that's because it didn't make sense to... Yeah. Anyway, I'll explain it when I make a video. Uh, I haven't done the Devil and Expert while playing post-shift yet. No, that's what we're doing 6 a.m. I beat the Devil in normal between 12 and 4 a.m. of post of night 6. Chat, you want to know a fun fact? I only do 4 3 2 1 with Freddy there because it makes you guys feel better. Because if I don't do 4 3 2 1, people get upset. But you don't have to do 4 3 2 1. Why? It says you have to do four, three, two, and one, and people take it as you have to do it in that order. But you don't. Oh, 
Oh, Bonnie? If Bonnie, we just lose. I don't know how to deal with him. Never learned. Don't care. It's unnecessary. Oh, we won. Okay. So it's time to play Cuphead. Why am I blinking? Oh, Freddy's gonna kill me. That's fine. So, Expert Devil at the same time as the final stage of Night 6. Good luck, thank you. Gonna need it. Oh, and I forgot my quarter roll. Quality start. Good luck, mate. Thanks, champ. So with this last section of the night, you only have to do five, six things to survive the whole thing. But they take a reasonable amount of brain power and then I die in Cuphead. That's that's what this challenge is. I attempt to accomplish a couple things in Elevator. I don't know, it's just okay, yeah, that's rough. And if you read the rules, we have three tries on Cuphead during the post shift night. One, two, three. One, two, three. Way to go, sport. Thanks. Okay. Did you see that chat? Crazy. As he was backing up, he killed me. That's remarkable. Oh my god. I practiced a little bit of the devil fight yesterday. But it's just hard. Like, there's no, like... I don't know, I feel like I downloaded the king. But you just gotta kinda get good with the devil. Thank you guys are warmed up. We'll be getting to phase two at least every time. But phase two, one HP is pretty fucking rough. Oh, I press numlock, and I'm gonna die. What? Oh, right. No, we have to sit. We have to sit watching the stage. I don't care. Please, let me restart the fight. No, I'm not splocked in yet. You're right. We probably want to just stay on this screen so that we can see if bro, whatever shows up at the top because that's the only thing he does that has no audio cue the drone doesn't have really audio cues but the drone doesn't matter as much for anyone who doesn't remember this night or just got here there's only two threats in post shift right now So, like, even comprehension-wise, this is probably the easiest part of Night 6. But it's really just... It's really just Cuphead that's kicking my ass. I'll occasionally check on the drone over here because that he doesn't make a sound effect for that either. 
There we go. So in this case, we have to go call the guy over here. And then we gotta do his cute little puzzle. Come on. Uh, fuck. I pressed numlock, dude. I pressed it again. We gotta take that key the fuck off. And then I gotta be checking here. Because he could come right back here. Since he's not here, I think he's going to be at the elevator next. So I should check on the drone. Okay, that's chilling. And then just go back and check here again. Remind me to take my numlock key off so I don't accidentally press it while trying to super... Elevator. Shit. <sighs> I think that was three cuphead deaths. But yeah, chat, like, post shift is way easier to do than the devil experts, so. But we're dead to golden, I think, here. Uh, we have Amalgabots. And I don't want to win post-shift. Oh, we're dead actually in post-shift. I don't want to win it, but once you run out of time, you don't instantly win. You have to do those- You have to do the webhooks and orders. So yeah, that's, that's the run. And we gotta do both. Thank you, Numlock Key. Numlock Key is off. That's what we'll spend the next little while doing here. Yeah, Expert Devil is a little, he's, he's a little bit faster and he's got a little bit more HP. A little, little bit more whoop ass in his tank. I actually got a lot more HP. That's the biggest difference. So because of that, we'll actually be spending most of the night on the fight. Even if we beat it first try, it's still going to take the majority of the night. Which will be tough, but also cool. I much prefer this challenge when I'm able to play both at once. Look here. Okay, he's not there. We got Robit though, I think. No. It's just like a bait sound effect. Ah. Ah. Not bad though. Okay, there there's a Malgabot. Probably dead here. Oh, shoot. 
No, we lived. Not bad. Ah. So we're probably, but I mean, we got to beat the, the post shift. Like, we almost have to beat the devil on the first try, because otherwise it's gonna... It's t it takes too long. Like, we the post-shift night isn't long enough to do multiple devil attempts. So I'd have to go over the 200 seconds in post-shift, and at that point, I'll probably die. Luckily, I think you only have to deal with golden once. Yeah, stupido. Is it a devil fight for each phase? We did... Oh, zero five. We did a devil fight for 12 to 4. We didn't do anything from 4 to 6 because it's too fast. But because we didn't do anything for the second phase, I decided that it would only be fair if we did a expert fight to kind of balance it out a bit. Rose that elevator. No way you're flashing already. No, okay. No, you are. One, two, three. Ah, not long enough. Unfortunate. Ah, wrong button. Miss input, likely dead. Wow, not dead. Incredible. Uh, bad time. <laughs> bad time, you guys. No. Q isn't. My Q's not working. Oh, I probably can't do it while he's there. Yeah, okay. Dead. Thanks to the raid. Errol, thanks to the raid. Boy Wonder, thanks to the new tier one. Does that say 15 hours? Yeah, not today. But it's day four. The quarter roll, yeah, so one extra little piece of difficulty is I have a quarter roll weighing down my shoot button. And between only phase one and phase two, I have to pick up the quarter roll and put it back down in order to keep shooting. Otherwise, I will just stop shooting. So when he starts going in the hole, I have to pick up my quarter roll, and then as the screen goes to the tunnel, that's when I, uh... I'm not gonna change my shot. I wanna hear no shot recommendations unless you've been here for at least 10 hours. Yeah, give it up for hours 16. 
Oh shoot! Ah, ah! <clears throat> Catastrophic, buddy. So yeah, right here I have to lift up my shot and put it back down in order to keep shooting. And I should check on the stage. He's not there, so I should check on Amalgabot. And then as soon as I'm done dealing with Amalgabot, I should go back to deal with, uh... I should go back to the stage. Okay, we're good. And then it's this phase that gets me killed. <laughs> there she blows. I am using the spread shot in the devil's eye. And if I fail to, it's just a seal issue. I do know that using it in the eye is the best idea. Wait, what? What? I saw he said go to the stage immediate. Did he say elevator? Uh oh. You did say elevator, didn't you? That's unfortunate. One, two, three. One, two, three. Sad. You can swap weapons to be able to shoot again? I'll test that. Do we have another quarter roll aficionado? Okay. That might actually help me a bit. Ah. Use the spread shot on a Malgabot. I don't even know which Malgabot's the the drone. Yeah. I don't even know what the other guy is called. Funky Mango Post shift enemy. Hey, I know new people are watching the Revenant's End. That's what it is, yeah. I know people, new people are watching the jump scare tier list I made because I'm getting a lot of. Why does he say mango? Comments. <laughs> Which is a classic. Alright, so somebody said I can just change shots. Oh my gosh! Nice. That's really handy, thank you. I don't know who came up with, like, the... The quarter roll tech, but I appreciate the quarter roll tech. Makes sense. I mean, it you know it reinvigorates my shooting, or whatever. But I'm just surprised that it's known. Yeah, like I want to get in his eye. I'm aware of that, but there are just other things that mess with me. Crap! This is attempt three, I think? Yeah, sure. We have 70 seconds, chat. We should actually get Golden Freddy. Uh-oh. Oh, doing that during this flame move is... Ah! Okay, so Golden Freddy is going right now. But I have to deal with this guy first. And I might have just died to RNG because of it. Like, he needs to show up. I gotta do his puzzle piece. 
And I still gotta get back and deal with Golden. But I don't think I make it. Oh, I did! Alright. Unfortunately for us, so at this point we could finish the night. We've beaten Poe's shift, but I, I'm not going to finish the night. I have to beat the devil before I finish the night. Because if I finish the night, I'll have to go all the way back to uh, the start of the night again. I don't get the 6 a.m. checkpoint anymore. So I'm not going to win. Oh, there we go. Yeah, no. I guess what I could do when I'm, like, waiting for that is I could do web line. And then just wait, but... Yeah, it's, it's, it is over. <laughs> Try saving your super for stage 3 like you did last stream. So somebody said that... Um... Like, four well-placed spread shot X's are better than a super. So I'm trying to have four spread shot X's. But do you think I should just get a super instead? Oh, fire move, of course. Yeah, yeah. Super is easier, yeah. Yeah, I could try with super. Just like I need that third phase to die. Because uh, it kicks my ass. It's too early, dude. Hey, buddy. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> three deaths to the fire move, chat. Three or three damage to the fire move. It is so, so terrible to me. Uh, phase one, so cracked, dude. You're on fire, Spiff. Thank you, thank you. Really tried my best here. We should actually have an Amalgabot, yeah. I still got hit. I still got hit. I don't know if I get hit by the hands or by the imp, though. I think that's I think that's three attempts actually. I think I have to, I think that's it. Got to lose in post shift here. When you phase when you hit phase 3, go to the left and prioritize shooting down the flying thing. Okay. I like that idea. You can't so the hands thing can no longer be ducked under. We, uh... That was in an old version. <laughs> the end of phase one, you can stand on the edge of the hole and you will not die. That could be useful. Yeah, so my mindset right now is just like beat down phase three as quick as possible and dodge, but killing the things that hit me might indeed be a profitable strategy. No! <laughs> However long I wait before jumping to do that move, it's never long enough. This move should be half as long. 
<laughs> the devil's too hard. Oh, I, uh... Didn't have my super. Thought I had it. Unfortunate. Do now. One, two... Three. One, two, three. Okay, let's save up for my super here. Oh, dude, unfortunate chat. I think we're dead. Might not be, though. Okay. No. That was pretty good, though. Yeah, so the spread X would do more than the super, but the super is a lot easier to hit. Uh, the reason I died in post shift is whenever you deal with the revenant's end, there's a chance he immediately goes to the stage, and I didn't check that because I dealt with the amalga bot. Even after dealing with the amalga bot, I neglected to check it though. So that's my bad. There's not too much value in standing next to the hole unless I'm doing something really pressing in, in post shift. Because I do want to beat Cuphead before post shift. Fuck off. Uh, uh. First phase without damage? Plink? Dude, not. Not, not when the fire comes out. One, two, three. <laughs> One, two, three. Okay, we have some post shift learning that we can take advantage of here. Let's go straight to the stage. Let's do stage first, okay. Now let's check Amalgabot. We do have a body mask Amalgabot. Okay, now back to stage. Jeepers creepers. Good, 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 good. Good, 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 good. I have no DBD. I have no DBD trick tips. I suck at DBD. I went too late. You know what? Late is better than too early. I'll get there. No, dude. Fuck. Uh, I gotta check here. No, we're good there. Okay, chat. One HP. Let's get it. Oh, unstable. We can get golden out of the way. Okay, we have one more cuphead attempt. We pretty much finished post shift though, so it's gonna be kind of awkward. Immediately, elevator. I, these are two very complicated tasks. <laughs> Damn it. That was a bizarre. 
Zank. I mean, a third attempt, Cuphead. Come on, chat. It's not really in the cards. Again, we could have finished post if that attempt. But uh, pretty much any time we get golden, we probably could beat Cuphead. That Or post shift. These are the same game in my head. Because uh, Golden Freddy is like... It's like the third element that can really mess with timing if it shows up at the wrong time. That was nice. I shouldn't have taken that hit. That was a bad hit. Attempt to... Let's open up with the fire move! Yeah! <laughs> I love the fire move! Yeah! Oh, I dodged the wrong direction. Uh, do we even do Cuphead Attempt 3? I don't know, dude. Uh, what's the point? Fine by me! I also believe it just might take a while. We really we up the ante by doing the devil on on expert. This was not something I ever intended to do, but it just was a cool light. Fuck the fire. The whole challenge hasn't been on expert, just this fight. See, this moves. I, I think that moves cool. It's not the fire move. Anything beats the fire move. There's no shame in going back to nor normal difficulty. Well, I would never forgive myself. So there's that. We've reached hour one. Remember to stay hydrated. You got this, Spiggly Wiggly. That's a lot of shame, actually. I don't think you realize how much shame there is. We will bring them into the night. We will make them see the light. You are peace in our great puzzle. You are peace in our great puzzle. Uh-oh. What? 
fuck that, dude. We are so done. Unless... Ah! Oh, we didn't die. Okay. Oh, uh, that was really good. It was a really good phase two. Uh, you know, the, the team fourth quarter, we just kind of team fell apart a little bit. Uh-oh. This is gonna be close. Where am I? Where am I? Oh my gosh. Okay. Going for the gusto, chat. I may have gustoed too soon. <laughs> Just win! Just beat the boss! Just beat the boss! <laughs> I have three HP! Wait a second! Yo, this is kind of killer, chat! Okay, I don't want to win, though. I don't want to win. But I was so good! But it was third attempt! <laughs> if we did that in Cuphead 20 seconds quicker, we finish the web line and we win. That was, that was, that was the goaded attempt, chat. Let's get another one. Uh, but I just didn't finish Cuphead quick enough. Oh, it's so happening within, you know, the next year or so. I can see the light at the end of the tunnel. That was fairly goaded. NGL. I don't even know what I was thinking about. I think I was thinking about my gallium. <laughs> I was like, I wonder how cold it is right now. <laughs> I also made a football analogy. Maybe that helped. I dodged the wrong way. How did that hit me? That's some... Master class nonsense right there. Uh oh. <laughs> Fuck off. Uh, it's just how she goes, I guess. Whatever. Oh, this is a bazank. There it was. Okay. 
Nyam 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 nyam. Use the cards without full charge. They do more damage individually. Okay. I'll get you to open Cuphead. I'll get you to... Uh... Make cereal with one hand while watching YouTube shorts. And then I'm gonna ask you if you'd like to use the powers individually. Have you seen the Plinky mode before? Kitty play. <laughs> that was terrible. And we have this Amalgamot too. Spiff, what are you doing for 250,000 followers beating this? Hey, can I lose? Thank you. All these different kinds of animatronics in post shift to make me think about another game you have played. Before. I have big friends. Are you my new friends. Small, Small friends. friends. Big friends. Somebody did an MFN speeder in a GDQ. I wonder what category they did. cool to see so this spider i can kind of avoid with my peripherals because you just kind of stop walk to the side stop walk to the side stop walk to the side pretty cool and that's good oh i thought i was gonna hit by that let's go okay Nice Sue. I didn't see if there was an imp coming. There was an imp coming. Come on in, bro. Okay, I think we have uh, Amalgabot doing some nonsense right now. So I gotta check on him. Yeah. Okay, then we gotta get back to the stage. Good. Uh, elevator immediately. Nice. Oh, we got a... Oh, bum, 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 bum. oh, that was a good run. Oh, it was a good run. Real unfortunate chat. Very sad. Okay, now I gotta restart Cuphead. We got a drone right after drone usually happens very infrequently but we got a drone right after a drone Just unfortunate. Nope. just kept droning on Where am I? <laughs> oh, I pressed numlock. I pressed numlock. I guess we'll continue. 
I wasted super because I pressed numlock so my jump didn't go off. And I was looking at post shift when it happened. Or Cuphead? I don't know. The other one. I removed the key. It makes it harder to press, but it's still pressable. Was not tracking the chips. What would you say is the hardest part of this night? Cuphead, probably. Uh, the hardest thing about post shift is just waiting for the RNG to line up well. I guess. No, the hardest thing is learning. Once you know it, it's just RNG, hoping that it lines up well. But the hardest part is Cuphead. We've beaten the Poe Shift Knight like four times now. But we gotta line it up with Cuphead. Oh, there was one more spider attack. I was immediately shooting up. Unfortunate. And the fire attack. Okay, it's uh, let's just take the L actually. This is my first time playing Cuphead. Though I have beaten the game now. Your peace in the great puzzle. Fuck. Uh, let's take the L. Let's get hit, and let's let's give it one more good Cuphead run here. If I die in PS2 after beating Cuphead, do you have to redo Cuphead? Yes. The point is to, like, post shift is the priority, I guess. It's not about being Cuphead while playing post shift. It's about beating post shift while playing Cuphead. If that makes sense.
Will I ever just play Cuphead? Well, about half of Cuphead, I played just Cuphead because... I had to get between bosses that I was associating tonight. Unstable? Did I press... No way I pressed numlock, dude. Oh my gosh. Actually, catastrophic? Oh. Apparently, he's not here. And we died in Cuphead. Okay. <sighs> Maybe it was Elevator. It was Elevator. It's okay. We died in Cuphead anyway. Put a thumbtack on the numlock? What can I do to just, like, not... Not press that. I have some sticky tack. I could, like... Remove the key? No, the key's off, chat. But, like, the key's still there. If you take a key off the keyboard, the button, he's still there. I might be able to unbind the button. Yeah. I'm not sure how, though. I have a Logitech keyboard. Is there... Wait a second. Motherfucker. <laughs> Hold on. <laughs> oh, my... Gosh. No, I don't actually seem to be able to... I can apparently only change my F assignments. My cuphead keybinds are here, I'll show you because it's been a while. So the reason I keep pressing numlock is because up, up, right, left, down, switch weapon. Jump is my delete key, and then this is my dash, this is my special, and here's numlock. So I'm playing, and I go to press special, and I press numlock, instead of going up to here. So instead of boom, I go boom. That's what I keep doing. The keybinds are insane because post shift you can't change the keybinds and post shift owns WASD. So yeah. That's where we're at. The key's off. Can you not take out the switch? I don't know how. Pretty sure every keyboard has an unlock. Pull it out? Wow, the fire attack. Fuck off. Small screwdriver works? Okay, I'll see. Might have time. Probably not. Oh! Ah, of course. Seventy seconds, we'll have golden soon. Surrender yourself 
And we won in post shift again, chat. So I got ruined there because I didn't realize that the poker chips were going a different direction from usual. And uh, I, so I jumped to the other side and that's where the poker chips were going. I won't be able to see your streams till August, but first wish you good luck until then. Come on out, Numlock! Come on out! I don't have pliers on me. But hey, we would have won there. We can do it. Damn, you literally made it to the easy part. Almost. I was a touch off. But yeah, I know. I know. I know. I've beaten the devil a couple times. I know that I was at the easy part. And then fire attack. Oh. Oh, spider attack. Okay, okay. I hear you. You are peace in a great puzzle. I One of these times, chat. One of these times. <laughs> one of these times, for sure. Dude, I got hit by the teardrop. So you can parry the teardrops, right? I've never really bothered because I have like that phase lasts no amount of time. Yeah, I did know that tears are parryable. I've just never even bothered with it. Manifesting so hard right now, dude. I'm manifesting too. I want to go play Inscription to be honest. <laughs> 
I'm like, all right, finish posted, and you can go play fun games. And the longing? Jet, that cobweb might be done? Fire ability. Ah, and I got hit by that. And then I sh <laughs> Okay, whatever. <laughs> Classic, dude. Oh, I don't have a... It's <laughs> I really do have to parry the tears. Nice, dude. Nice. No, I really... I There's so many tears in Expert. I'm just not used to it. Let's die. Let's do it again. This is... This is... We are on the cusp. Yeah, we're getting there. Doing the super on phase three is baller. You don't have to, you can jump around the chip and not hit the tears. But that seems, it seems easier to parry the tears. I'm, I'm looking for the easiest path. Yeah, you want to restart post shift real quick? Not yet. Please just finish this damn challenge. It's easy. <laughs> no problem. Just give me give me a couple secs real quick. Equip the auto parry? Smoke bomb is way better than auto parry. I there's not even a competition there. Wait a second. Uh, I don't have many. Uh, can we have? Probably have. Shit, we do. I gotta go. I gotta go. I gotta go. I gotta go. Okay. Uh, yeah, that was unfortunate. I turn. I must have turned off the stage. Like. The moment that the uh, bro appeared on the stage, I I shouldn't have even I don't know. I dealt with the drone when I really shouldn't have yet. No. Ooh, okay, that's a roughie. <laughs> there goes a cup of dry.
and open it up with a banger. Best move in his arsenal. If he just spammed that, I'd never make it past phase one. Hey, Spiff, do you think you'll ever do expert cuphead deathless? No. Fuck. Oops. What did I just join in on? Walkie. Happy four months into our relationship, big ball torture, big ball torture, big ball torture. Probably dead to drone. Did they say anything? I swear they didn't say shit. No, that's three cuphead deaths. We did our best, believers. This attempt was dead pretty early on, but I I tried to keep it going for you. But uh, it was three cuphead deaths. I had an early reset. It was two. That early reset counts. My 310 balls. Dude, that's like the amount you get for following plus watching for 10 minutes. You're never gonna get that back. The grind continues. You know, we haven't actually beaten... Well, there was the one time that I probably could have beaten the devil that I stopped because I died in potion, so... I'd say we've beaten the devil once today. Did you want the first one to count? Are you asking if I should give believers one more try? I don't know. That's the mods thing. <laughs> Hmm. 
I wasn't even shooting up. I was so distracted there. I was thinking completely about post shift there. I hardly realized where I was. Got bad. <clears throat> I was like thinking about the prediction. rough that was like it was really good until i died really bad in phase three of the devil but i was so focused on post shift that i completely lost where i was like i was going off peripherals muscle memory at best in cuphead In phase three, I can use the super to also kill one of the side guys, so I should hold off using the super until a side guy shows up. Is what you're saying? Because that's smart. I'll do that.
All is right there. Okay, yeah, no, it's... it's, 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 it's. <sighs> hey, Spip, in your opinion, what is harder, King Dice 1 Expert or the Devil on Expert? I haven't done King Dice, but the fact... on Expert, but the fact that you can get 6 HP in King Dice makes it significantly easier, in my opinion. Oh, I didn't even see the imp. I think you should get some blue light glasses. We worry for your eye health, Spig. I think I should beat this. Time for a break? No. No, 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 no. I am like so close. I've been on the final phase of the devil on the cusp of beating post shift like six times. Mind you, I don't survive very long in the final phase of the devil. I have one HP and I die instantly. But that aside, Yeah, that would be a death if the prediction was done. No, it is. I am a little baby subman, but soon it'll turn to years. All resets count. I don't even want to do a phase two recently, one HP. Me, also, Chicken Ninja would be proud. Yeah, he didn't say that he was proud. I don't think he had much comment on it. Well, I was mostly asking about his... Yeah, it's because I asked about his video stuff. He had nothing really to say. If you asked kindly, asking the devil to let you in? Hey, we had a number of runs in a row where the devil didn't spam the fire move. So, that's about as close as we get to the devils telling me I'm allowed to win. Is minimal fire move usage. Yeah, speak of the devil. Yeah, exactly. I like the bubble. Although I prefer it when the pink bubble's at the bottom to start so I can get it. I normally can't get the pink bubble when it's not at the bottom. Last month I said I was starting the Solemn Tempest grind. My highest score is 2,000 meters, holy moly, this is going to take a while. You got it! If I can post head, you can post a dub on the Solemn Tempest. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Who is it? Hmm? 
I think that, that blinking must be a bug. The blinking's a bug. Great. And it's continuing. So now I don't know if I'm about to die or not. Oh, is it stop? I don't know. I don't know what's going on. Golden. <sighs> Just go for the teardrop. I tried to go around it. I'm not going to go around it. No, I'm just going to die. Why don't I use the homing gun? Because I can only have two guns. And I'm using the other ones. Does it help that I don't get to practice the last phase that often? Getting there though. I guess I should wait a sec. <clears throat> What did I just join in on? Walk. I said it would probably take a couple hours. We're almost at two hours. But if it takes four hours, it takes four hours. Nice thing is we're beating phase one before things happen in post shift. Handy. We got the drone early, so drone shouldn't bother us for a sec still. But I should check. Think my okay. What 
wanna just join it up and walk this. Eleven months is crazy. Must lock in for the final push. Come on. I can't even back out. It's up to RNG. That's crazy. Damn. Webhooks took so long. Well, we got a good cup Edwin. Now we just gotta line up the RNG. too bad I maybe could have checked for the fan guy but because there was no blinking you you pretty much always have time um oh let's just go lost 20 seconds on post shift fuck it let's go yeah You usually have enough time to do the webhooks if nobody's blinking, but then it took forever, and, uh... The bro got me. It was good. Dude, we were at phase four with three HP. The not so instant, instant artist. No, certainly not. Phase four with three HP is pretty damn cracked. We weren't even like halfway. Well, I think we were maybe halfway through the web hooks, though. It took an insanely long amount of time. Real unfortunate. <laughs> this is probably going to get me hit. Oh, nice gaming. Do this. <laughs> yeah. All right, another good round. <laughs> he's got this. Oh my God, he's locked in.
Let's do this. Dies immediately. All right, all right. All right, all right, all right. The consistency really is forming though. Phase four, each attempt, like, come on. One of these times. I'm gonna do web hooks, just see how long it takes. Takes a long ass time. I think this is also bad RNG, but damn. Thoughts on Genshin? Uh, not as good as the Sisyphus game. No. Oh. shouldn't oh that's <laughs> might be a uh, actually fairly uncommon like early post shift rng death unless we survive okay okay i see you Yeah. Damn. <clears throat> so I was on cam two there. And it can show up on any one of the cams. I went all the way to seven and it wasn't there. And then I got distracted and died. Look at the purple dude. <laughs> Every attempt will be close until we get it. Because I'm getting good. Yeah, I know the minion's pretty funny. What happened to three cuphead lives? I don't have this night's too fast. I don't have time for three oh, cuphead geez. lives. We so close to finishing this. Stay hydrated. People. So it's pretty much one cuphead life per run now. Cause the night's too short. And then when I take damage to fire, I, uh, just reset anyway. So I guess we get three, we get two early cuphead resets. Our dos. Oh, I'm going to take damage from that. Do I reset? Nah, let's play this out. Oh, 
Oh, I'm glad you liked the content warning video. We actually probably have no, no drone. Company needs water. He's been in hell for three hours. More than three hours. I always get so like discombobulated on what I'm supposed to be doing uh, in the moment. Uh oh. Yeah, dude, that's not good. Don't die! Let's parry a tear. Okay, yeah, there we go. I couldn't, like... I- I couldn't do those puzzle pieces without taking a damage. I- uh, but I needed to take a second to parry a tear for the first time. I'm sorry, chat, I was super dead there. I really- Cause, like, I gotta look over to see where they are, and just, I would've... So I focused on Cuphead. And, uh... So this doesn't there's no prediction, never mind. Doesn't matter. I feel like you should be like skip that cutscene. I don't think they really expect people to grind the hell out of the Uh let's go no gamba for a bit, no. Yeah, he's doing it on purpose. I really just love doing this over and over. Oh, you can skip the book by pressing escape. Okay, cool. Thank you. Uh, hopefully, I don't have to. Hopefully, the next time I beat the devil, I also beat... Bush. How many hours do I have in Cuphead? 17, probably. <laughs> I have as many hours as I've been doing this challenge, I suspect. What did I just Because I bought the game to do this. Spite made me come back to post shift two. Hashtag fired is so slay. Connor, what the hell does that mean? It was like a comment that somebody put on a short he made of me pretending to fire him. And somebody was like, no, don't get fired. I love your editing. <laughs> Hashtag fired is so slay or something. I don't know. I don't get it. I Is Spig getting older? Not like more than. Ah, oh, man! Dude, I got. Oh, Rogue Bubble!
actually catastrophic, Chad. The only thing being hashtag fired is Cuphead in hell right now, Flink. <laughs> ah! Let's see how forgiving this is. I deserve to die here. I didn't mean in Cuphead. <laughs> wow. Unpunished in post shift. What an easy game. <laughs> Did you mean in real life? Yeah. No, I meant in post shift. Can you be unstable a little bit quicker? I'd like to restart Cuphead, please. How do you not get burnt out halfway through? Spite. Sure, it's annoying to do this for 17 hours, but you know what's worse? Letting post shift win? I'd rather do 100 hours than let post shift win. I probably won't do the cup build DLC. At least not right away. <laughs> I'm certainly ready for it, even with my scuffed control setup. In fact, when I do do the DLC, I'm probably still gonna use the same controls even if I'm only playing DLC because I'm used to it. Like, what? Not using my numpad to play Cuphead? Whoa, 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 this is wrong. Oh, crap. Oh, nice. He gonna sneeze. again <laughs> we were in the exact same position the puzzle plus phase four. Oh my gosh <laughs> i can't do those two things at once it's like the most hands-on part of the entire like post shift night with like you can't take it you can't take a break the, the phase isn't hard but you can't pause you know like you can't stop anyway anyway oh my goodness leave it to spiff to not clutch yeah i'm more of a endless grind type <laughs> I was looking out the wrong way, I didn't see the end. Wait, what? Oh, okay. Oh, dead, most likely. <laughs> I 
In five words, explain post shift. Uh, react to noise, win cuphead. I have no idea what the lore is of push it. Probably something to do with robots. It's usually how she goes. How does the elevator guy work? Y you need to make him stand up by opening the door for a certain amount of time, and then when he stands up, he leaves. And what that means, I don't really know. But it's what you do. All right, two HP. It's nice, like, at the start of the day, it was like, oh my gosh, a two HP phase two. Now it's like, two HP phase two? Yeah. You know? Kind of cringe. Uh-oh. <laughs> that bomb went very far away from me. Uh-oh. Double O. Uh, Spiff, please let it end. You know, I think the Saturday crowd is less patient. It's only been two hours. Okay, Joel. Only two hours? The fact that you say only two hours shows me that you're less patient. How, like, have I ever done something that hasn't included at least two hours of staring at the exact same screen? Let's push for 20. Not a 20 hour stream. I'm not doing that. But yeah, somebody said that I'm overkilling with my first super, so I guess I save it for the start of phase. I don't think I'm overkilling. Maybe I'm. The NAC UCN 5020th mode had different backgrounds. Yeah, we see different screens. You're a piece in a great puzzle. Okay. Okay. Well, we don't have a super now for this phase, because we beat this phase too fast. Although we can get it. Yeah, okay. Um, problem is, where the fuck is the drone? There you are. Oh my gosh. Wait a second. That was so fast. Whoever said I'm blowing my super way too early on phase one? Where were you two hours ago?
Let me get golden right away here. So, let's play this smart. The web line truly takes a while. We'll probably, probably deal with each threat one more time and then go for the web line. Now the drones hopefully spawned. We take care of it. There we go. Okay, web line. Dude, we already got the drone back. Uh... Okay. Well, we can't get out of this menu, so... Let's commit! 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 <laughs> RNG! Let's go! Name of the game! Wow. That's time. Let me switch my mouse back so that I can end the timer. And just like that... In 17 hours, 38 minutes... We proved that Post Shift is one of the easiest fan games ever made by beating the expert Cuphead Devil alongside it. Fantastic. <laughs> that was uh, one of my dumber ideas. Sorry for ripping on your patience, chat. I was also getting impatient, and I took it out on you. But we're done. <laughs> Post head has been beheaded. So true. If any of you want to do this, I'll show you my Cuphead controls so you can copy them. Really pro level gaming. Move down, clear, jump, delete, shoot, backspace with a quarter roll pressing it down. Page up is EX. Switch weapon is down. I don't even know what lock does. <laughs> I guess I'd never changed the input. What the hell is lock? Man, eh. and then dash is page down. It means lock in. Dude, if only I had that input. We could have won a lot quicker. No way. And then my... These are my... Mouse controls. Additionally, you need the Q. You need the key Q and R. So I have them on this half keyboard. Q R. And now on top of all that nonsense, you're going to need the proto input uh, program in order to run Cuphead at the same time as post shift, okay. You're also, I don't know if it's 100% necessary, but you might also want to open Cuphead through special K so that you can have it not pause when it gets tabbed out of, okay. And you're also gonna be wanting to run this program because otherwise you can't change the window size of post shift, you can't normally do this. This is not normally an option. 
It is only thanks to this program. This was terrible. <laughs> Truly terrible. Let's play some inscription. <laughs> uh... Yeah, I'm playing Chain together with Daco and John next week, chat. Daco actually reached out and asked to play. Which is unreal, because normally I have to hunt the man down, but he hunted me. Wait, do I still not have right click? Hold on. Yeah, whoops. Daco's hunting me for sport? That's so exciting. Spig big enough for Daco to reach out? Me and Daco have been bromigos for like over a year. It's just, he's a busy, he's, I'd say he's busier than me. I don't know. Okay, like, the difference between, and I don't know for sure, but what I imagine Daco's workload in mine is, is like, for me, you know, I got 12 hours to dedicate to stream and editing, and I just kind of do whatever. Whatever comes up, I do. Whereas Daco's like, I think, he's like, wake up in the morning, Record video, edit video, that's his shift. So, like, he has a much more consistent schedule than me, which means that adding things on top of it is harder, I think, for him. I'm just guessing, but that's kind of how I see it. I actually talked to 8-Bit Ryan about his schedule once. And he was like, yeah, I get up at like 7 a.m., start recording. I'm like, whoa, whoa, whoa. slow down. Are you telling me you're self-employed getting up at 7 a.m.? He's like, yeah, I always like to finish before 5 p.m. Like, whoa. Chat, some days, it's like I'm getting up at 10.30, streaming until like 5.00. And then I spend three hours with Paige. And then it's like shift two is 8 p.m. to 1 a.m. Running a nine to five as a self-employed person is just not... Not how I run. Not post shift two. I've been getting... Pretty decent. Like, I get up at, like, 9.30. I'm not that bad, but... Um, 7 a.m.? Like... It's crazy. Okay, sorry. I'm just... My... Eh, you know... Okay, there we go. You get up at 6.30. Okay, like, I've gotten up at 6.30. I'm not, like, incapable of getting up at 6.30. But if your work or school or whatever has no time associated with it, getting up at, sorry, I'm putting the keys back in my keyboard. That's, that's what I'm, that's why I'm just sitting here talking. Um, getting up at seven when you make your own schedule is pretty unreal. But yeah, I've had plenty of jobs where I needed to get up at like six. I've, I've, I've been there. I can relate. Just not for the past few years. It's not that unreal. Well, it is for me. Congrats on finishing Posthead Spiff. Thank you. I got Cuphead because you were playing it. Yeah, it's a banger. Have fun with Inscription. It should be super fun. I will play the DLC at some point, but I am, I'm kind of on that Inscription grind right now. Got up at 5 a.m. today. Which is an hour before my target on school days. That that is impressive. You and I, you know, we're 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 made different. I don't know. I really get a burst of energy in the evenings. Like most of my editing is done between like nine. I should unplug this keyboard while I'm putting the keys back in. Most of my editing is done like after nine p.m.
I do get the afternoon zoomies, yeah. Which act am I in? That's an excellent question. Um, I beat the game once. Like, I beat bro. So, two, probably? Still one. Okay, cool. Cockroach! Uh, it's a long game? Hell yeah. For two, you have to kill that dude? I killed that dude! The decrepit wood carver appeared before you. She moved with a certain vigor in spite of her considerable age. Squirrel? Here from 157% FNAF World Fox. Oh. It would be nice to sub spig loaf shake. Dude, I love having the squirrel head. It's not as OP as the the reincarnating squirrel. <laughs> In order to get to two, you have to use the room. I've been doing a bit of room stuff. Hey, Spaff, I'm glad you're alive today and not playing a game that makes me motion sick. Yeah. I mean, I don't know if post would have made you motion sick, but it's probably... Why does a stink bug look like a Ghibli grandmother? <laughs> okay. <laughs> Don't worry about her. I. <laughs> All will be explained in Act Two. Okay. I probably shouldn't have done this. I don't know. I'm gonna hold. Oh, never mind. I just won. Is this like once a card dies, it's gone? No. Well, no. I'll be clear with ye. The trap in business been lagging. <laughs> After being defeated by that challenger, me, I'm thinking of clearing the inventory, trying something else. Pelts are cheaper now. Okay. What's the description? You are just going to have to observe the video game. Nah, sorry, bro. Business is dying. I'll just take the free one. Can you play Cuphead while playing Inscription? I'm actually down to, like, play a chiller game after uh, extremely high octane post head well this is uh, epic stinky bullfrog chat R. do the room puzzles all of it stinky. and when you see blue go to the clock hey. or you play act one forever also spin I I've already wiped that information from my memory but also thanks to the 200 bits wizard <laughs> I prefer to just figure the Ooh. spicy Yeah, no story backseating unless I ask, please. You're more than welcome to backseat my gameplay, I just might not listen. <laughs> it's 
looks like buckshot. Yeah, it does kind of. All right, go, Stinky Wolf. Confused by the gameplay, what's happening? Oh, it's my cards versus his cards. Left is damage, right is health, and then they have special abilities. Like, I put Stinky on the wolf, which means if it lines up with another card, it, uh, that card does less damage because it's so disgusted by my Stinky Wolf. And I can pick a card to add to my deck. I choose Mantis, because it's kind of cool. Oh, I can add Mantis to my Stinky Wolf! And then, yeah, like, each state, you do fights and you do funky upgrades. In this case, I'm sacrificing the Mantis to add its power. Oh, I can't add it to my wolf. I'm changing my mind. <laughs> yeah, sure. What did I just join in on? Walkies. This is one of my favorite games. I hope you enjoy your playthrough. Try not to die. I'm like, this is where I'm at in keyboard reconstruction. And I'm trying to figure out what goes where without looking. Okay, no, it's grid. I'm looking. The sea goes there. Okay. You can only add sigils to cards once. I see. But if a card already has two sigils, you can add a third, right? So these birds have an insignia on them, which means that they'll, instead of hitting my cards, they'll hit over top and hit me. Which is kind of not cool. But... I actually gave my stout, which I'll be able to get, the ability to block wing hits. But then also, my wolf's already doing more damage, but no, I'll get the stout in there. He'll win this against the bird. I don't know why I did that pelt. Whatever. I do like inscription. I know I have to move around the room. That's probably my least favorite part. Whatever, though. It's not a big deal. I'll work it out. The sadistic pronghorn. Woe to those that meet the end of its antlers. Yeah. I like the beaver because the Canadian build. <laughs> yeah, thanks, Jeff. <laughs> and for no other reason at all. Yeah, I'll actually take that. Sure, let's try it out. I'm not too proud of this yet. Just like anything squirrel is great because I have so many, well, you just get squirrels. This is the first boss. Uh, I'm so sick of this boss. It's a funny game, Chad. It's a very funny game. Probably honestly pause some because I'm about to get bones. Watch the last- yeah, I've streamed this twice already. Mm -hmm. 
He's got nothing that does damage. Interesting. I'm kind of just wanting to beat this first phase. Oh, yeah, sure. There we go. Because then he kills my front line. There's gold in them curds. The beaver spawns a bunch of extra stuff with it, but I just don't have the lanes open for that. Now I do. So now I can get two squirrels down so that I can snag the beaver and get a damn. Hell yeah. But I win anyway. So that's boss one done. And you get a rare card. Canadian build? The, uh, f that filthy feral hog, it becomes incensed when the chimes are struck. The douse. And the amoba. Okay, wait, what does this do? When a card bearing the sigil is played, a chime is created on each empty space. Nah. Oh, I clicked. We got the ads build, chat. We're in the wet. What is that? Simple. Use it with triple blood squirrels, yeah. I'd like to sacrifice Oh yeah, this one. Uh, I'd like to sacrifice the douse. Still just one bone, bro. Does anything besides the goat give more than one bone? <laughs> no, I see. Unfortunate. Oh, yeah. I choose corpse maggots. Thank you. It's the blood sigil, not the goat. Fair enough. Give me my stinky wolf. I'm not gonna click the bone coins. I know that it orders them right and it makes chat happy. We don't need that. This has flight, doesn't it? I don't know. It does, damn it. I just soft locked my, my lane. Feck. <laughs> uh. What does this knife do?
Gross. Nice. This isn't much fun if you're half blind. Perhaps you'd like to replace it. Oh. I want the plant eyeball. Fill your empty socket with something magical? Find salvation. Cuckoo clock. Better? Regardless, the choice is final. Oh, this is kind of cool. I don't want... Well, I, I am missing an item. But no, I want a fireplace. Bah! Yeah, Mantis is good. Let's push it with this. Enhance the power? Mantis, faux show. We have two mantises, so we can risk it. Surely your creature will become more powerful, but you need to risk another moment by the fire. Oh! Yeah, no, I'll just I'll keep my three one, dude. As one of the survivors began pulling a knife from their pocket, you withdrew. Does that mean I survived dying? Bone zone. So yeah, chat, that mantis attacks diagonally, but it hits two squares, which is super nice. So it can do six damage for the cost of... So I can do... Yeah, I can do this. Just get it in my hand, put this down, and instantly win? Oh my god. <laughs> Cracked! The mantis build. What's this cave? I forget. Oh my god, there's a fire though. No, let's upgrade the mantis. <laughs> Cockroach? Yeah. Is it power? Oh my god. <laughs> Sweet. No, I don't want to become more powerful. I'll take my four damage. My eight damage, one cost mantis. Why would I do the other one? Because I can just start fights like this. Yeah, one cost. Hmm, I don't recall making that one. Bug? Alright, I'm gonna go octopus, because I'm curious what it does. Oh, I could have undying mantis. Oh my gosh, I was distracted. Yo, no, let's beaver mantis. The Canadian Mantis. <laughs> what are you doing? I'm having fun. Fish. Canadian Mantis! <laughs> Flanked by its dams! Die already! Go fish.
Thank God for the dam, am I right, chat? We just win, right? Canadian Mantis for the win, chat. The dams literally saved me. <laughs> You're oh, if the dams weren't there, the sharks wouldn't have been there? I don't care. The dams literally saved me. <laughs> Mantis God! Oh my god. Yeah, always big mantis guy. So true, dude. So true. Mantis build. <laughs> oh my gosh, now we go to the fire pit to upgrade the mantis. Genius. Genius, chat. Oh, do I have pelts? I think I have up pelt. I'll take your finest. Cockroach on Mantis God? <laughs> Undying Mantis God? Health plus two? Okay, the question is, do we do we put the Mantis God or just the 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 dickening mantis? I think we stick with the with the with this mantis. Oh, I'm so afraid. It's not like I'm just instantly going to win. <laughs> that mole is it. I wonder if that mole is going to get a turn. No. Oh, so scary. Oh. Ever since that defeat, well, I don't want to hear it. Cheaper prices, enjoy. We have so much money. Hell yeah, just give them all! <laughs> I don't want anything. Do I have to click something and then I just... Whatever. The Mantis God attacks three directions at once. So it's better than my Mantis who only attacks two directions at once. Bye-bye. I see a path where we could give the mat. Oh, Louise. I see a path where we could give the mantis... Because we could give undying to the mantis god. But, like, I think all of our chips are in the... I don't know, this isn't going to get me much. Yeah, I know the cuckoo clock. I'm- I'm in a run! I'll check it after. I could... Mantis God to something else. Or Roach on the Mantis God. Mantis God to Mantis? Wait, what the hell would this do? Would this 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 wouldn't this wouldn't stack, would it? 
No. Roach God. <laughs> Hell yeah. Tax five times. Yeah, that's what I was wondering. Wait, I can't hit twice. Oh my gosh, I can't instantly win. It's so over, Shaq. Bro has to actually think? Bro. <laughs> uh... Tough. This is tough. Yeah, I think I'll do that. Ooh, it's this is tough. This is tough, Chad. And I, I think, I think I'll just, I think I'll uh, just end my turn. Yeah, that was that was tough. You know, that was tougher than usual, for sure. Okay, I'm gonna stand up. I'm gonna check the clock. Ah. Get, get, get. Oh. Yep. Unless. Wait. Don't worry, Chad, I got it. I figured it out. Take the film roll before he sees it. Uh, what are you up to over there? Nothing. Just relishing in my easy dubs, buddy. How do I turn? Oh. Oh. Hey. <laughs> Blackout, only so I can get boned up if given the opportunity. Wait! Mushroom the Mantis's chat! <laughs> the Gigamantis! I think it might make it weaker. Nah, <laughs> made it stronger. Just combines the stats, I think. Five, four, one cost Mantis Pog. <laughs> yes, the Trapper's Pelts. Yes, of course. I'm afraid I'll be skinning you today, Junior. I ought to thank you. How has it been? It has been quite bad. I am trapped in the body of a stoat. In the paper of a card. I see that. And I have, of course, set up a way to reset once more. Dot, dot, dot. Go on. They are already hold the key. Those good words. They are already hold the key. Oh no! That's not good. <laughs> so I might have to use my brain here. Wait a second. Damn! Oh, the damn attacks in two directions, but it does nothing. Yeah, yeah, okay, no, I was... I was almost popping off there. One of my top 10 games of all time. <laughs> it's over. <laughs> it's so over, Chad. We're doomed. We're doomed. <laughs> I 
I don't even know what to do. Oh, you'll be fine. Yeah, I think I will be. Only killing the dams. Let's go. The cockroach is in. Cockroach is in. <laughs> uh, I kind of feel like playing the wolf just to like. I got a lot of fucking pelts, dude. Oh my god, that's a lot of damage. <laughs> I see. Ah, the end of my turn. Let's trade. Oh yeah. It's funny, chat. I'm just gonna like, take the stuff that's in my way. I do, I do want to play, give me a squirrel, because I want to play the stunted wolf for funsies here. If I could find it, goddamn. Here we are. Yeah, okay. Now, ka -chow. Why are you question marking me, chat? What did I do wrong? I'm Obe. Uh. I guess Gek, chat. I guess Gek. The mystery of the hour trapper three. and trade occupies your thoughts rate. as you wander onwards. Thanks to the hour three. A light of the distance caught your eye. So this is where I won, I think, last time. Yeah. I guess items. I don't remember this. what this does, but scissors are cool. Because I've done this before, chat. I have the key now. Yeah, okay. Oh, yeah, moving. Are you purposely pronouncing a mobe wrong? <laughs> yeah. I really am. Oh yeah, the the plank trials. Trials of the board. I got all three of these last time. Definitely not. Potentially. Hmm. Does that count? Oh, come on, it's yellow! <clears throat> there we go. Chow, why do I still have so many pelts? I thought I sold them all to the uh two years pookie.
You bought more, you airhead? Oh. <laughs> That's unfortunate. You managed to get a boon. This may be a fair competition. Who is that? It's the it's like the dungeon master. <laughs> That's Yeah. You're back. See it. Well, looks like I'll have to beat him again. So true, man. Oh, how I relish and catch up this moment. Two flames will not suffice because I'm gonna get my ass whooped, so I need three flames. I don't even remember what he does. Oh yeah, it was some moon shit. Yeah, I vaguely remember that. Well. Dodge this. Auto work again. Slap that moon down. He took a picture of me. Yeah, okay. Watch out. Wait, can I just? No, I can't cut. Okay. No, you made more space for my cockroach. mod after you beat the main game the different challenges are really fun i have no idea what casey's mod is dude the mantis you're not the first to triumph over the moon but go on finish it <laughs> there we go finished dude mantis with damn mantis can be so cracked You had the respect of a strange... You had won the respect of a strange cabin's inhabitant. Your body quaked as the adrenaline of the battle subsided. Leaving you with a gnawing hunger you had not eaten for days. Is it not so? Woo! Woo! Meat pie! Surely this hey, food Stig, will please you. What was your favorite PlayStation 2 game? X-Men. I took extra care in preparing it. Thanks to four months, brosy bros. Doesn't meet your standards very well. 
stand there. This is the same. This is my little dub right there. Can I, can I leave? No. <gasps> I've got film. Holy shit. That didn't even occur to me. You absolute ingrid. Give it back. What? Good. Oh, there's a bunch of dead dudes in here. Dude, it's all a bunch of dead businessmen. That's cool. Alright. Hell yeah, Chad. It didn't even occur to me that I'd gotten film. <laughs> Just like, yeah, film. <laughs> I have no idea what this is for. Okay, I'm gonna fix something. My face is too bright and it's making me angry. It always goes on automatic. I don't know, it's weird. Now I'm too dark. <laughs> Go back. Eh, still a bit too dark. So the camera can only run on one program at once, so if I'm changing my settings, I can't be running my camera. Uh... On stream. Oh, that's why New Game was never available! I see. I gotta use the washroom though. I'll be right back. Well, maybe I should see what... <laughs> Unexpected data encountered. Uh... Purging deck data? No! My... <laughs> My mantis? In the beginning, the world did not know cards. That is, until the day the scribes arrived. Each had their own method of inscription to create cards. Remora used her quill to inscribe the epitaphs of the dead. Lashley used his wildlife camera to capture beasts. PO3 used a particle scanner to copy the CPU of robots. And Magnificus used his brush to paint his wizard pupils. With the cards created, the scribes had solidified their power. Until one day, a challenger arrived to replace one of the scribes. What? <laughs> Didn't expect this. That's me? Oh my gosh. Choose a starting deck to mark your ambition. I just want a mantis. You know what? No. Where's the robot? Robot. Your ambition is to replace PO3 and become the robot of technology? Yeah. Stuff lost again. You think you're getting past? Think again. 
Not until I get some proof of my girl's all right. All right. Piece of card back. All right. Yeah, I recognize them, yeah. I bosses. finally get to see my favorite playthrower play Inscription Plink. Can't believe it was all this. Woof, I was just about to call it quits out here. But now that there's a challenger in our midst, it's back to work for me. I should be able to get this bridge fixed in... Full disclosure, it'll take me exactly as long as it takes you to defeat one of those scribes. So, come back later. That's funny. Okay, so we gotta do one on the right. I guess... Let's check on the dead guy. Hold on, I gotta... I gotta... I gotta... I gotta... I gotta... If Connor's in chat, this is the closest you're gonna get to Undertale for quite some time. You're here, marvelous! I am Grimora, scribe of the dead. Until quite recently, I was disgraced. Though I was returned to my former glory with the help of <laughs> If you wish to test your skills against me, you must first prove your wits. You must discern which tomb marks the final resting place of my lovely ghouls. This guy got no legs. <laughs> this guy's got something in his noggin. Ghibli Grandma. She's the stink bug? You saved it to the bones and found a card pack. You received Deathly Card Pack. I'm gonna have so many cards. Oh my gosh. A Scarcophagus. Dude, hark! A herald, a slice of lemon approaches. Bright and triggers a lime. You think ye will squeeze a defeat out of me? Or something be wrong? Your deck ain't right. Return when you got twenty cards in it. Oh, okay. Funky dude. So these are like my. I got no wizard. Oh, I need to make a deck. Deck acquired! Dude, this is so different. Yup, I'm PO3, okay? You picked my starter deck. That means you have to learn to use energy. Do I really have to explain this to you? At the start of each turn, you increase your max energy. Spend it or not, doesn't matter. At the start of your turn, your energy refills to the max. Get it? So I don't sacrifice squirrels? 
<clears throat> After attacking skeleton parishes, K. Okay. Drop a skeleton in its place, I see, okay. So I probably want to kill that. No, there's still sacrifices because there's blood. Oh, the start of- oh, so I start with one energy only. <clears throat> See that? You spent your energy to play the card, but you get it back next turn. Sick of hearing from me? Well, I'm sick of talking. I got important work to do. You'll see me later. What's up with the barbecue? Okay, good. That was just the turn. Skeleton collapses into a pile of bones. Yes. What did I just join in on? Waffles. Please. It's a bell. It, dude, it looks like a barbecue. Kind of. I thought this was the barbecue. What's this? What? Oh, did I get an energy for it? Or did I do nothing? Huh? <laughs> you did nothing. Hammer deletes card. Got it. Forty nine er moves to a new space. I'm gonna get pooped on by all these bones. Maybe not. Do I just, do I just get cards as I play them? I guess. When a creature moves into the space opposing sentry drone, they are dealt one damage. Oh, I could maybe kill the boat here. There we go. Now I get to place the steamboat. Choo choo! This is just cost six energy and it's two two and that's it and that's kind of sad. Loaf, welcome. You're a little late. Hey, kitty. I'm still missing two keys for my keyboard. But whatever, I guess. Go with that later. Overkill damage exists? Did it deal it to the dude? No. Winning. Not winning? Winning? I gained a foil. So you gotta do... Oh no. No, it's still five. I just had three on my end. I see. I you beat the pup out of me. That's not a skeleton's voice. Skeletons don't make voice. They go... <laughs> Deathly card pad. Wow, so I'm like really gonna be getting a ton of cards and making decks. Okay. I got a rare. 
When another creature you own dies, it's returned to life and dies again immediately. Hell yeah. Because you bested me with ye, I'll share my secret. My name's Royal. Or... <laughs> okay, so this is his. Uh, tab. Let's... This deck sucks. Wait, it's 5-5. Five, five. It costs 13 bones? Bro. The ghost ship actually seems pretty cracked. Well, I don't know. Spiffbo to make the heaviest playable deck? Do these just, like, suck? <laughs> but they don't do anything. Your sacrifice cards. <laughs> Banana. What did I just join in on? Walkies. <laughs> I have no idea what I'm doing. Let's, let's do it. Oh wait. Will I ever play post shift two again? Probably not. So my bone count is zero, which means it's time to play. Ugh. When an opposing creature is placed opposite to an empty space, Bone Hound will move to that empty space. Oh my gosh, Loaf. He's gonna poop on my dudes. What did I just join in on? Walkies. Revenant, after attacking, Revenant perishes. <laughs> Goofy goobers, man. I don't have energy to play that. At the start of your turn, your max energy. Yeah, bro, I know that. Oh, it costs three. Wait, these. What? Didn't this just cost one? Well, Loaf, what do you think we should do? That'll hold him in place. There we go. The best decks combine some of all the card types. The cards that were involved in Act 1 were the Beast and Bones deck. Bone deck is Crack Teemo and the magical one is the worst. <laughs> oh yeah, I shouldn't have done that. Well. That's good, at least. That's nice. But like you got, you can't even use bone cam right away.
This interface is a lot harder to read, yeah. But good news. Cat. Be here. <laughs> so this just like this is a bone farm. So funny. Okay. Robots just like power up and then they become kind of cracked once you start getting six damage. All right. I'm picking up, just putting down. Sacrifice card. Oh, all right. This isn't necessarily all bone stuff. Well, Ruby Box is on the board. It provides an orange gem to its owner. All right. Ah. Thirteen bones, dude. Hey, Sawyer. Please don't go digging up my bones. Another hor headless horseman, dude. Oh, this looks good. Yeah. Well, kind of. I don't know. Hit by a falling piece of ice. Yeah, no kidding. We finished the post shift to run. Did someone leave the air conditioning on? Ha ha ha. Is that just me or do I have a hole in my head? Draugr? When the Draugr perishes, the creature inside it is released in its place. Let's like... Not. I don't even want to play that. Got a bone. So yeah, robot bone seems like our life right now. I mean, that's what we have, but like, it also seems good. And we have a headless horse in here, but like, to collect that many bones seems like a bit much. And if they play any more Draugrs, it's gonna close all the lanes. But it doesn't look like it. Oh, it does. Fortunately, we win. Practice wizard? When dead hand is played, discard your hand and draw new cards. I 
I'm in front of the tombstone. I'm from the tombstone on the left. Yeah, we figured it all out. Oh, I forget their names. I think this guy was Sawyer. Wait. Oh! Sawyer hit by a piece of falling ice. Okay, hold on. Yo, oh, you're Casey. Casey, hit by the ice in the ballroom. Sawyer, do not sniff or snarl. Interesting, I only know... I need to know all the details of their death. Brought down by scurvy, all right. Uh-oh. You have no offering? Yeah, I realized pieces on the ground, because I accidentally picked one up. These mean something. Eaten by a hungry dog. Unfortunate. So are they going to tell me now that I've found their epitaphs? Oh, you were eaten by the hungry dog. Okay, you died of scurvy. And that's not it. Still no offering. Okay. I need like the dates of their death. Maybe that'll be on their skulls. There are four skulls though. No. Life didn't give me lemons, so I died. That's funny. Defibrillation failed. Drowned soul. Nice. The well giveth. Well, no longer giveth. Ah! Okay, hold on, we got two of them. Is that just from talking to them? I'm avoiding looking at chat here. Wait, there's something up here. There was no cure. Okay, I... What? Not the mirror that turns you into a... Oh, it's just like a character selection thing, I think. What do we want to be? I like this guy. I like the default guy. All right. Piece of ice. Uh, defib. Dog, no grudge. Scurvy, there's no cure. Bingo. Marvelous, I believe you have proven your wits adequately. Are you prepared? 
you will not defeat me. Yeah, okay, stinky. <laughs> Bone Master over here. Easy free damage chat. <clears throat> oh, what? Oh, does it not do any damage otherwise? Uh oh. Scar Guffagus, not good. Say, so, okay, we come back from this. Twitch baby poggy. Potentially. Marvelous! An opportunity to use my quill! This one will be back. Uh oh. Oh my god, it's so over. <laughs> What rush you may try again, challenge? Okay, we should like maybe think about our build. Build. But I mean, we have nothing that like can be played early, so it doesn't really matter. Cause it's like we win late, anyway. I guess maybe some more of these guys. <clears throat> like we just have to hold on. So let's just get five of these. Yep. Some like quality bone time. In case we ever get to 13 bones. <clears throat> what was this? Hmm. It's a mix character. Oh, this could be helpful. And I guess more of these. Done. Yeah, I bounce my leg a lot, so the kitty uh, experiences it. Yeah, so now we live longer because we have a bunch of these guys. Well, it's too late. <laughs> we'll see. Yes, the Scarcophagus is a bit of a problem. I will play my own Scar- I will not play my own Scarcophagus. I will desperately cling to life. As I am relentlessly pelted.
Uh, okay. We gotta kill the coffee goose. to farm we just gotta get good oh sorry love you can go over 20 that's not gonna help really like doing two damage to the coffee goose. That's that's really a problem. Farming for better cards may seem like a good idea. Yeah. I could keep, I could hold the dog there. Definition of insanity? <clears throat> no, it's okay, I'm strategizing. Oh, whoops. <laughs> Done it. Professional strategizing. Well, I lasted a turn longer, so that does help. Death is never final. Killed by the thicky droid. All right, and see, now I've got a coffee goose of my own. Is this inscription? It looks kind of different. Yeah, I know. I didn't expect this. See, we got our own coffee goose. So this dude's only got like four cards that are repeating. Late game is simply too easy, Loaf. Oh, you got a bit of a clumping on your neck. Wait, does she have three lives? Or two lives? like what comes next no my coffee goose do you miss them fear not i'll give them back as corpses ah ha ha ha, ha. oh can i just place them all right well i still have max energy so we are still cooking None of them do any damage, though. Well, 
we'll get a lot of bones out of the deal here. But we have a coffee goose. That's a bit of a problem. Oh, no, you're welcome to the backseat. I just... Yeah. Really listen. But, like, I'm kind of cooking. Like, we're, we're boning it up. This card draw was very unfortunate, though. <laughs> Oh, dude, it's double zombie, though? I didn't know the zombies would be able to be raised. Yeah, we're cooking now, chat. Get the coffee goose to take damage. Whatever. Kind of delays my bones, but I'll still get them, I think. Yeah. So now we got the horseman. Yeah, now we're in. Deck is cracked. No changes needed. We can wrap the game with this crap with this uh, um with this deck. Really defeated me. I was not expecting that. Your ambition to replace PO is to replace PO3, but between you and I, there will come an opportunity to change your mind, and I beg that you spare me. Take these, then go. What do you mean? Aren't I sparing her by replacing PO3 instead of her? Frankenstein? Frank and Stein? Hell yeah. And another headless horseman. Uh oh, dead hand. Oh yeah. And we got the deer and we got the bullfrog. Battery low. Dude, that's my I'm having a bit of an issue with my headphones where like they only charge them like a, a baby amount. Of charge also by low so my headphones last for about 15 minutes and as soon as I put them in they say battery low oh, I thought this was the way out you wish to trade That's fun. So bone heap is like, however many bones you have, you can make it good. That's like really good. Cause situational. Is this just free? Sure, I'll take a skeleton. Hell yeah. Thing, ways to acquire bones. Oh, and the Draugr? Hell yeah. Because NPCs are goofy and they're just gonna kill me. Guess I'll save the rest now. Oh, this is the layout. Wait, goat, goat, goat cat. No, the goat cat. The goat. There was a goat. Oh, 
I thought I couldn't afford it, but I guess I can. Pharaoh's pet is counted as three blood rather than one blood. When the sacrifice does one first, but the sacrifice doesn't first. Eh, I don't like. I'm done with blood decks. I want to try other things. So he fixed the bridge. Challenge me, let's see your dick. Oh, nice dick. Weak cards, total lack of synergy. Bro, he doesn't, he doesn't understand. Look, I'm trying to finish up my conduit control list here, but the bots they're sending down the line are trash. Get those workers to send me something good. Tell them to throw themselves in the line if necessary. And please have a decent deck by the time you're done. Oh, this is the stove? Oh, that's why he was getting so square. Did you, you said I'd like him. I still don't like him. Yeah. What is it? What do you want? I'm very busy here. BO3 isn't happy with my output, but I am merely the inspector! To put better bots in the line, I would need to... Just who are you? To be carrying orders from PO3. PO3 would only trust someone with some semblance of card game skill. Funky. I come here. I should have put some cool bone stuff in my deck. Too late. None of these do damage. <laughs> Other creatures within a circuit completed by buff conduit gain one power. Okay. Okay. Let's kill this guy. No. Uh, uh, uh. <laughs> Don't move, dumbass. Null conduit may complete a circuit, but provides no effect. Okay. Oh, cause the it went back in. Okay, hold on. We got things going on. Things are happening. Problems to address. This whole circuit thing seems like way more complicated than it needs to be. Like for me to want to use it in the deck as opposed to just like kick ass, take names. Also, whoever said misplay, game too easy. I couldn't make a miss. Wait, what? Oh, yeah, no kidding. <laughs> couldn't possibly make a misplay. Conduit make, can make you have infinite energy? But is anything hard enough to make you need infinite energy? Oh dear, your message from PO3 must indeed be legit. As I mentioned, I'm a mere inspector, not an engineer, not a designer. I cannot send new bots down the line myself. Or, <clears throat> I cannot send new bots down the line, but I can send myself. <laughs> Rip. Oh, hold on, there's something there. Oh, oh god, conduit stuff? Uh, 
Oh, if energy conduit is part of a completed circuit, your energy never depletes. Okay, but you can only... Like, you won't keep picking up cards. One energy to deal one damage to the creature, a creature across from Plasma Jimmy. <laughs> That's fun. I like that. Yeah, the energy dump card. Yeah. Forcing it is getting harder. <laughs> I'm not even. I'm I can move. Wait. No. I can't move the numbers. I'm not looking at chat. I refuse. I will brute force this. In my own. That you can only put it on the zeros. Oh. Wait, but then why is... Oh, but I need to place them all. Yeah, okay. Uh, I'll figure this out. Sure thing.
brute forcing wins the day. Yippee. I actually refuse to learn <laughs> how that works. Monkey on a typewriter does it. I am the matter. Not another word out of you. We must have a guard battle. Bring it on, motherfucker. You know what? I kind of wanted to deck. Deck it up. We're kind of deckless right now. Die and redeck? Yeah. I'll do that when I die. If. Perhaps when? Perhaps not. We're kind of decked up right now. I'll be honest, PS3 was right about my deck. I think these AIs trying to use all this fancy dancy connect the dots formula is uh, an error on their end. I think they are too simple of creatures. You should know about errors. Chat's choosing violence today. Just for that, we're doing the rest of the fights with this deck. That is difficult, you see. I melt the metal, but cannot reprogramming the stamping machine. There is a way to send at least one new bot down the line. Ha ha ha, yes, for PO3. Oh no. After oh fifth, no. I hope your day is going well and that loaf has gotten fed and petted. Much love and have fun. Oh my god, I'm so cracked. <laughs> Maybe I am learning how the puzzle works. No, I'm still brute forcing. Don't you dare assume that I'm learning how the puzzle works. Oh, my eyes are closed. Oh, I'm just brute forcing. Eyes are closed. That was a complete accident. Wow, the monkeys are really typing up a storm today. Oi, mate, I know what you're here for. You're asking me to take a dive. But I can uh, come at each and make a special orders in it. <laughs> Looking at dredge something special. We could deal. Aye, maybe even give you something if you win. But I can't be taking a dive. Be a three, be understanding. Catch me. Catching the dub on this one, Jeff. Yeah, what, mate? Can't take me eyes off work, eh? Yeah? I'll give you this one. Oh, see, the deck does it again, Chad. <laughs> eh, take it back. Oh my gosh, it's a mantis. Th 
That seems pretty good. Mantis is reborn. Nah, off with you. I need to concentrate. Life! Is that... PO3 is going to want me big for this one. Oh. There's something wrong with this blob of metal. Alright. Grizzly? What's the prediction? Oops. Is the prediction, will I beat the boss with my shit deck? <laughs> Aphrodite, thanks to the new tier one. Didn't know you liked Twitch streams. All right. So yeah, we go until I either win or I go, this is not worth the bit <laughs> and give up. Well, what's over here? Swap to the death deck? I'm thinking I'm gonna stick with the uh, the shit deck. Nah. Give me that deck again. <laughs> My god, it's still so dog shit. Wow, you beat them with that? <laughs> All right. Maybe there are some synergies that I missed. Let's go then. See chat? Synergies that he missed. Oh god, this is awful. At the very least, they ought to test your lane positioning. Good lord. Does that mean that I'm gonna get his cards? Meat bot. Yeah, but you lose your cards? Who cares? My cards suck. <laughs> run! Run, car! Run away from the conveyor! Yeah, thanks to the meat guy. Too bad I have no blood cards. Holy shit. When explode dot dies, the creature opposing it as well as adjacent friendly creatures are dealt 10 damage. Jesus, bro. Maybe I shouldn't have done that. Oh well. Oh no, chat. We're gonna get the melter. Crap. Well, we'll smack this guy then. Oh, I do get a bone for it too? Stellar TBH.
Does this adjacent damage... Does it? I don't know how it works. I think I've figured this out. <laughs> That's what the melter is? Bro, really? Ugh. So freaky. This is fun. This is a cool system. I'm running out of damn cards though. That's a bit of a problem. But I do one more damage here and win. Oh, scanner's online. Which card to scan? Just kidding. Obviously, the one with the best stats. Oh, yeah, you got my dog. Jesus. <laughs> Your move? Bro, my move, I'm running out of cards. <laughs> Scargophagus! <laughs> I need you to do work! Fuck! <laughs> Whoops! Mistakes are made! Well, I get the robo dogs now. Not gonna lie, chat, this is kind of over. Like, first try with the shit deck. Oh, get better cards, Spiff. Spiff, you can't just use. <laughs> Guess playing a perfect game is no match for RNG. Your. The way that arena was set up is was literally beneficial for worse cards. Because I just got his and he got mine. Oh, no. And you've even decided that I am the scribe you'll defeat. As if you have a choice. Hmm. That is... Dude, like, we quit post shift. We're... We're out of post shift. I'm not reading that. Mrs. Bomb seems crazy. Oh, we're out of battery. Oh. Never doubt the ability to bang your head against the wall until you win? I won first try. What do you mean? We did plenty of banging today. But not in this game. Uh... I don't think we've seen these. These are new. I think I've just got to send it. To whom it may concern... Isn't that right? Hello there! Exclamation point. My name is Luke Carter, and I'm a fan of your collectible card games. If He's got D&D &D dice. Videos, you will know how appreciative I, I got an Xbox controller, old speakers, so a, a wood carving of a deer. Version of inscription. I think maybe one of my fans pranked me and buried a copy in the woods near my house. Upon further research, however, I have not been able to find any record of this game. Is this some kind of elaborate hoax? Who's he emailing? Any trace of this game? Is this some kind of elaborate hoax? The game doesn't seem like the work of a prankster. It at least appears professionally made. I am both puzzled and excited by this discovery. Any information you can provide would be much appreciated. Thank you, the Lucky Carter. Okay, good enough. Sent. Yeah, I don't know why it's Minecraft text font either. <clears throat> What's up? It's me, the Lucky Carter. Hey, card gamers. I'm the Lucky Carter, and this... Well, it's a bit of a strange video. Um, it's actually more of a question to my audience. As I've learned over the years, nobody knows card games better than you guys do. So, so I'm true, hoping Chad. someone can help me out here. 
Did anyone ever play an inscription video game or hear about it? I'm talking about that vintage one set card game I opened packs for last week. I don't know what I'm allowed to say. I don't want to get in any trouble here. Um, I think I've got the only known copy of the digital version of Inscription. I've been uh, filming myself playing it and... Uh, yeah, I'm thinking of putting out a Let's Play. It's weird, guys. <laughs> uh, I don't want to get in any hot water by showing the footage, but can someone please prove me wrong? Please tell me someone has a copy of this game. I have been looking online for days and I cannot find... I reached out to the publishers, hoping maybe they would get back to me. But as a fallback, I got you beautiful viewers. Beautiful. Hopefully dig up something. Um, that's it. <laughs> that's the video today, guys. Uh, thank you so much, as always. Wow, I could post and daily we, 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 if that was all I did. Oh, yeah. uh, <laughs> what the fuck is the... Hi, been a while. Oh, that's, that's the... That's, that's the time travel code that's tattooed on Fry's ass. If I made videos like that, it would be like, hey, morning chat, I bought gallium, gonna melt it. And then that's it, guys. Hope to see you tomorrow. <laughs> I might eat it. And that's it. Post. Which reminds me, we gotta heat this up, so I'm gonna turn my heater on and... Sorry, hold it. Mr. Carter, we have received your inquiry regarding a digital version of our intellectual property inscription. We can assure you that no such software exists in any official form. However, if you have indeed come into possession of proprietary game theme hardware, you are compelled to return it to us under the Computer Fraud and Abuse Act. The hardware will be considered stolen if it is not returned to us within a reasonable time frame. Please carefully package the hardware and paste the attached shipping label to the front of the box. You may mail the package at a local post office. We would like to avoid taking legal action in your case, so please do not delay in returning your proposal. I'm taking it pretty software. seriously. Sincerely, Game Funa Customer Happiness Department. That's a Nintendo email right there. What the fuck? Yeah, true. Oh my god, Nintendo got him, Chad. I think this woman's actually from Game Funa. She came to my door yesterday, and I didn't answer. This time I'm gonna record it. She's gonna whoop your ass! Hi! Hi there! Hey. I'm floppy disk for a game called Inscription. I was told he came by a copy of it somehow. Dude, they got his address uh, off an email. No. No? No, I don't know anything about that. Yeah. Inscription, you said? Yes. No, I don't think so. Really? Because, um... Really? Because we tracked your IP. You are a Luke Carter, right? Oh. <laughs> you know the Lucky Carter gmail.com? Yeah, uh, you know what? That's, uh, I am Luke Carter, but that's not my email address. Is, uh, oh, they got I've him, noticed because I've seen your videos. Oh. <laughs> oh. Thanks for watching. Listen, uh, yeah, how there do you we know go. where I live exactly? My boss gave me your address. And how did you get past the side gate? It's locked. I jumped it. <laughs> okay, Luke. Um, I'm going to give you my business card. And if you remember anything, anything at all, feel free to give me a call. Docs, hate to okay. see it. Happens to the best of us. Take care. She saw the video camera, decided to not bring out the knife. What the fuck? Yeah. Hey there, card gamer. Nice chest. I'm the Lucky Carter, and this is another pack opening video. Today I'm opening Secrets of Legendaria. Hoping for that sweet, sweet foil Valamir. He's 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 holding himself well, chat. That's it. Makes me self uh, self conscious about my my uh you know. 
my stance. I can't do this. Filming one minute videos. I'm burnt out. I'm burnt out, Jeff. I can't do it anymore. It's too much work. I guess stop browsing footage, yeah. Alright, we're back in. The TikToks are too hard to make, yeah. I'm positioning the, the gallium by the heater. By the way, the heater blew my breaker the other day, so just like... It probably won't happen. Because both computers were on and that's not happening today. But like, just, just letting you know. Curve hopper? Sure, I'll take a curve hopper. I'm not gonna eat the galleon, for fuck's sakes. <laughs> Greetings, if you're reading this, it must be because you wish to challenge me. Magnificus to a card battle. In order to earn that privilege, you must start to defeat my three graduate students. You must first kick my three unpaid interns' asses. Ooh, gems? Ooh, ooh, that's... Might, uh, might be a layer too complicated. I got a monocle. In normal inscription, what was my favorite card? Probably the moose. Oh, wait. There's skulls on it now. Skull, wing, skull. Okay. Where is unpaid interns? Unpaid intern one, I guess. Yar! The pain is unbelievable. Oh, is this the guy in the jar? Turn into goo for my final exam. I just have to defeat one more challenger. Then I'll earn my rightful place. Oh, poor guy. Little does he know, I have the Giga Deck. I've been bad. subbed forever and ever and stuff. I have no clue what this game is. It's a card game. Fluffy, thanks for the three months. What did I just join in on? Walkies. So this is kind of the same deal as the energy then. Thanks to the tier one Scarlet Witch. Star Scarlet Witch Bussy. Thanks to the tier one. This is kind of like the energy. <laughs> you were just waiting for me. As soon as I say it in chat, <laughs> you're just waiting for me to thank. <laughs> Thanks for the sub. her tweet in the new Wicked Wiz video when you ratio D the Garden of Banban devs and I got so excited lol. New Wicked Wiz? Because I ratioed them like a year ago. Maybe over that. A troublesome series. 
walkies. All right, where's? Oh, I saw myself. <laughs> I saw spoif. Spoif. Probably best to read the room before you start pointing fingers, as others are likely to point back. This is where Astral Spiff, a streamer who has contributed to the mascot horror space, came in with a ratio-worthy recommendation to actually take some time and make something worth the money. This was then taken to YouTube, where they made a very clear defense against this reaction. You see, this was a question of morality. Is it scummy to beat a game within two hours, come to your own decision that it wasn't worth the money, and refund it, even though you used it for content. Personally, I'd say yes if that's your overall strategy. I wouldn't trust your opinion if you're not exploring that deep. But the point is that there wasn't much to explore here. A question in response to those in protest of this behavior is if it would be dishonest not to truly express one's opinion via legitimate means. The ability to play through all available content before the two hour mark with clear padding only highlighted how little there was that and the poor practice in play. Truth is, as a customer like anyone else, it's their right to refund it. The risk of how that's perceived by the public then falls on them, and the fact that it's possible to get the full experience within that refund window comes down to the devs. Just like everybody else- Yeah, bro's cooking. Cool. Yeah, I mean, he just reiterated the point I made. <laughs> spiff reacting to spiff that's my favorite thing to do just react to myself in people's videos can't believe that video has a million views what the hell my hating on i haven't my hating on ban ban video has a million views that's wild i don't want to react to my own videos no i don't want to do that Now they just got four nothings. I can't so even. Have we moved on from let's plays to reaction right. videos. Look, I react on occasion. You should react to out of spiff when I drop it on extras. Yeah, I will. I will, Connor. Don't worry. I'll add some context to your out of context clips. I like, I can't even hurt him more. I'm so sorry, Goopy guy. You had literally two cards that were capable of dealing damage. And like, I killed them both and that's it. This is kind of miserable. No, please. I'm sorry. You just didn't do enough work. Just tell the master I passed. He won't know the difference. Okay, I'm down for that. Chat, I can feel fluid <laughs> in the metal vial. More gems. Completely forgot about that drama with the Ban Ban developers? Yeah. I pretty much just like went back to because probably the only criticism that my video received was like you're talking about them you're giving them attention which is kind of true um so my approach since then has just been to just not i haven't interacted with anything ban ban in quite some time Don't worry, their games are still shit. Yeah, every time a chapter comes out, I say, Hey, chat, how was the chapter? And then you guys say, Well, uh, kind of bad. And then I just move on. <laughs> yeah. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. What? What? Where'd it go? Oh, it's over here. Okay. Whew. The top isn't very, like, I don't know. It's not very secure. So I gotta be careful.
So it's, it stayed secure though. We're good. So I have to puzzle this... This gem thing. Suddenly it springs into motion. I'm fighting a dummy? <laughs> if a creature would attack the force mage, it does not. Okay. What's up with these terrible decks? Dude, I have nothing that does damage. <laughs> My decks know better. This is the first symbol, skull. Then arm. Skull, arm, wing. Okay. Could you like infinitely farm money here? Hey Sprunk, it's my birthday today, so I won't be able to watch, but have fun. Happy birthday, Adegnus. Skull arm wing, I think. I hope you have a grand birthday. Oh my gosh. I think Piked. The intern was like killed for his final test. <laughs> Magnificus will award be the highest honor. I hate this guy. This guy's an asshole. It just dies. Okay. Interesting. I am t uh, taking the dickening, though. And have nothing to show for it. Mox cards on the owner's side of the board gain one power. Yeah. I'm about to lose.
I don't think there's anything I can do. Yeah. Okay, let's change the deck. This deck sucks. Surely I only have to wait a bit longer. Back to my mattress. I'm no longer the stubbornly sticking to my crummy deck. So the bottom has a, bun a bunch of it's melted at the bottom. When I want to take some out of this melted guy, what should I put it into? <laughs> An ice tray? Something made of aluminum. I mean, my hand is what I'm tempted to, yeah. I just don't want to lose it. What's it even for? Fun. Alright, chat, let's go bone. Bone time. Bone only. Well, maybe not bone only. What did I just join in on? Walkies. This seems like a banger deck, chat. Whoops. I don't want to farm. No. You know what? I think this thing might do better at melting if I just hold it in my hand and then use the heater. Just imagine your cloud floating above a volcano. So Chad, the basis of this deck is uh, the leap bots sacrifice themselves until the bone boys are able to get in business. Not gonna work, bud. Well. Hmm? Shouldn't this guy be gone? Because there's no more. Maybe it'll happen on his turn. Yeah. It should happen on his turn. So I should be good to play Bone Barrier. There we go. And then we just go... Boop, 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 what? Oh... Oh... <laughs> I see. 
I should have known, chat. I should have known. Kill it for the bone? Yeah, you're right, actually. Okay, well, knowing that, that that works that way, I would like to change one thing about my deck. Probably just kill the grave digger, unfortunately. Yeah, this is unfortunate. This this deck sucks. This deck is worse than than my last. Bye, buddy. My god, an energy card. Bless. We can play something. <laughs> Go, heap. Oh, pay two bones. Damn. <laughs> There we go. Go bone heap go. Ah, yes. No bone heaps. I don't know. Just win. Okay, that deck sucked. We're gonna need a couple more uh, electricity dudes. The gun did not think how I work. Oh, I thought it did. You received a magical card pack. Chat, when I first got this scallium and I was like, how can I heat it up to 30 degrees Celsius the easiest? My first thought was like, I'll pop it in the microwave. <laughs> Which I obviously didn't do. I realized immediately why that would not be a good decision. The top sigil is found by the greedy. Okay. Bottom sigil is found by the hard of hearing or by those who hear too easily. The middle sigil is found by the pale. Greedy, heart of healing, heart of hearing. Yeah, I don't know. Bunny. Greedy, hard of hearing, pale. Well, 
Well, the first one's probably Skull. This, I guess, just leads to the bottom. Ah. You know, I'm gonna, I'm gonna not, I'm gonna close chat. Just me and you guessing thing. So that's greed. Greed is that. Hard of hearing is that, because he was quiet. And then we just... Ta-da. Alice! Stimulation! I got chat, it's you. My test has been sensory deprivation, you see. To unlock the full potential of my mind. It's unlocked now. Hear me, Magnificence. I'm ready. We have to battle? Okay. Coffee, enemy. Oh, crap. I didn't fix my deck. Well, at least we have Super Bone. Oh, shit. <laughs> bone hip appear- bone? Bone heap appears to be the basis of... Skeleton gaming. And then it died. <laughs> Just fairly unfortunate. Come on, I need better cards. spaces oh all right Give me Frankenstein. <laughs> that was incredibly stimulating! We aren't Hello. done here, right? I wish to see the light again, to sing, to dance. You wouldn't leave, would you? I don't know if I have a choice, Jan. I open the door. He'll stop by on the way back and let me out. Right? Maybe. Okay, let's fix this deck. It was 
a bit of an incident. All right, Bone Heap, Pog. Skeleton, Pog. Draugr, Pog. Headless Horseman doesn't get fucking used. Gravedigger is nice. Scarf Coffee Goose. You. Now! The gang. Conduit? Nonsense. This fun car guy. Absolutely. Bomb. For shits and gigs. The funny gun. For shits and gigs. Curve hopper. Sure. And then the thicky. And yep, that's 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 it. Why so much energy? Because it's good. Electric bones is correct. Yeah, comments would be fun to mess with if you had more than four slots. I would agree. Dearest Grimora, I believe PO3's plot may go far past the extent of a power common power grab. The note is incomplete. It ends abruptly. I urge you to consider. This guy's been painting. That's what I can see through my monocle. Ah. Uh, wait, is that his face? <laughs> I thought that was the back of his head. How do my pupils fare? No matter. There are far more concerning issues at hand. Do you understand the canvas that you have been woven into? Nay, you are the brush. And the artist moves you with a terrifying mastery. My eye aches with premonition. The future is very, very grim. First, we must battle. Bring it, paintbrush guy. Behold, the brush of the scrap of the magics. My pupils would die to be painted by it and live forever as a card. But that is not the full extent of its powers. This one needs some bleach. Thanks? The skeleton just got way better. <laughs> awesome. Nine HP. Now you're dog shit. <laughs> That's unfortunate. Well. Oh well, I guess. I'll take my bone back. These plus ones, ain't it? Oh, 
Oh, the spikes was nice. Fight just makes my fun niche cards useless. I'll take the bunny. That's fine, I guess. A bunny, a, a bunny, bunny, bunny? This fight's actually a good bone farm. Oh, we're gonna get a Ruby Mox. Fabulous. Thanks to the 200 bits, Ashley. See, electric is kind of goaded, because now I'm just gonna be getting cracked electric things. This is, uh... Oh wait, it switched to a rabbit. Never mind. Yippee, a rabbit. Oh wow, yeah, the thick droid with spikes is actually insane. Double gunner with spikes? Yeah, I mean, this ends pretty soon here. Hmm. I must be slowing down with age. I may need to set my brush upon my own cards once again. Probably, you've really only been helping me. Like, this whole spike stuff? Very nice. Yeah, you might have wanted to change that one. <laughs> Hell yeah, more overkill. Toughy right there. All right, how melted are you? It's pretty melted. Very well, we have battled and now I may speak. You see, my eye, it aches because I am a new Chia. It was exercised, excised by none other than Leshy. The scribe of beasts. And a beast he is, arrogant, single-minded, obsessed with gaining power. But he is far from the worst scribe to become Hegemon. <laughs> you see, the injection of my eyeball is far from the worst thing that can happen around here. Come on, focus, hold on. 
It's liquid. You see that? That's metal in there. I might go get a plate and put some in my hand. In a bit. Chug, chug, chug. <laughs> Stop the lemming. <laughs> Lemming bad. What is this? Oh, hey, buddy. So we gotta visit that guy and let him out. Or no? <laughs> Unfortunate. Buddy, I know this place. Stop shaking. The only thing you have to fear is your own inadequacy. Behold me, I am Leshy, the scribe of the beasts. We share a desire for you to challenge me. But first, I know what you're thinking. No. This is not my legendary camera. Not the one I use to create beast cards. This one is a mere replica. You may use it to create photos of the beasts in these woods. My subordinates, the prospector, the angler, and the trapper, they each require a photo before they will consider battling you. Return to me when they are all defeated. Yeah, unless she last, yeah. Fish, no pass. I remember this combo was in the game, and I think the first digit was a two. You really cannot... Oh, yeah. God. Like... A lot of people... Have no respect for the... For the brute force. Get him! Snake a pick! Oh, 
Oh, it's right there. Dude, I thought that said two equals three. <laughs> well, I'll be damned, that's my girl. I'll let you pass me an entry on the pond. But dang, nab it first, we got a battle. <laughs> Squirrel. Ah, uh, yes. Are you gonna sacrifice things, or are you just gonna, like, play squirrels? Yeah, he'd be pretty OP if you could hit the person. I get it. Uh, yeah, you can use Astral Spiff email, or just DM me on Discord. Do I know what squirrel tastes like? I've never eaten a squirrel. Okay, it's time. I'll be right back. I just want to make sure that I can get it back into the vial. So I brought a plate. It's time to touch metal. To the tune of... Journey. I just looked up OST on YouTube and clicked the first thing that came up. <laughs> eh. What am I doing? I should just have me like this. I say I'll even put on the chat. <laughs> Spiff yearns for the gallium. I guess that's the best angle. Oh my gosh. That's so cool. Oh my gosh, that's okay. Wait, wait, we gotta get a we gotta get a cam of this. Hold on. I'm gonna close it. That's so cool. It stays together. That's freaky. It is real nifty. As chat continues to malam.
Yeah, and it sticks to my hand in little bits. Well, because it's also, like, it has a melting temperature of 30 degrees Celsius, so it is also, like, it's solidifying. What's the texture? Water. Like, it doesn't feel like anything, really. It's hard to break the surface of it. <laughs> Don't lick it. I'm begging you, please. No, I'm not gonna lick it. It is the forbidden soup and it'll stay forbidden It like it stays together really well. That's that's different from, from water I wonder if I can like yeah, and like on my finger my fingers picking up little bits of it. What even is that? Gallium. I've always wanted to hold mercury, and this is a non-toxic close equivalent. It's metal. It's metal that melts at 30 degrees Celsius. Bang 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 bang. I'm gonna smell it. That could have been my hand, but there might have been the smallest bit of rust smell. It's so cool. Huh. I appear to have acquired a lot of, like, dust on my fingertip. Look at it. Look at it from this angle, too. Smell my other hand for comparison? No, no, it does smell like rust. It does. Which is not, probably not terribly surprising, because it's metal. <laughs> That's fun. Alright, I'm gonna try and get it back in the tube. Or I might just, like, let it solidify before retubing it. But I can make a little river with my hand. All right, I got the majority in. What's left in my hands is just like tin foil, basically. So now I'll put the rest of this from my hand on the plate. And then I'll get it back in the tube. Oh my gosh, it made a droplet! That's so fun! A drop of metal! And like, on my- Oh, it's so hard to show this. The camera's so ass, but... On my hand are like a bunch of tiny droplets you can see. Okay, hold on. Eh, don't put that gallium near anything made of aluminum. Spitz is like a child. My brain! Only more dangerous because he actually has the means to acquire potentially dangerous elements. Not my aluminum robot brain. That's cool, Chad. That's pretty cool. Yeah, so I'll let this harden. I wonder if it'll stick to the plate when it hardens, but... Uh... I'm gonna let it harden and then I'll get it back in the tube.
<laughs> Luxury dining. The rust smell you're getting is from the oils in your hand mixing with the metal. Well, that's fun. Look at this little metal droplet. Oh, pretty Can you microwave gallium? You can microwave anything. Doesn't mean it'll go well. Look how gray my fingers are. I got like star dust on them. Worthwhile purchase? Definitely. Gallium would destroy aluminum. Did you mean that the ga did you mean that the aluminum would destroy the gallium or the gallium would destroy the aluminum? And what is destroy? Cause here I have a beer can. <laughs> And I have a droplet of gallium remaining outside the tube. Shit, it's already hardening. Okay, there we go. I don't know, but I kind of expected it to explode. So, like... <laughs> what do I do with this? Bare metal? It needs to be liquid? The can has a coating on it? What about at the bottom of the can? Put it inside the can. Scratch the can. Gallium seeps into aluminum and weakens it over time. Anyway. I guess keyword is over time here, chat. <laughs> Can we get back to the game? Yeah, sure. I'll leave my gallium and aluminum can on the side and see what happens. This has been an exciting science with Splav. Think it needs to be liquid? My aluminum can. All right, well, let's see this video. It's 
now been sitting here for about 12 hours. 12 hours. And I don't need this piece anymore. I then ended up leaving the bat here for a few more hours. And when I came back to it, it was all crusty for some reason. <laughs> when I tapped on it, though, it felt and sounded almost exactly the same as regular aluminum. No, the gallium's going to make my beer can crusty, chat. No. It also felt pretty sturdy in general. However, <laughs> it definitely had some issues. Everywhere that the gallium had infected, oh, shit. it had become extremely brittle, and it was now completely useless as a baseball bat. That's kind of cool. That the gallium may have multiple purposes. We may have found a bet another use for gallium besides holding it in our hand. Spiff, what element are you gonna review next? <laughs> Uranium? Arson? I hear bismuth is really pretty. Yeah, I Three. don't know. I guess I'll go through the elements one at a time. I actually, they sent a periodic table with the gallium tubes. By the way, I have two tubes of gallium, so I have a periodic table now. Gallium is here, and aluminum is here, chat. They're neighbors, it means they hate each other. Yep. Next, we buy uranium. <laughs> hey, real question. Are some of these elements on the bottom just like made up? Like fake? Like theoretical? But like, do they exist? They are human name. They are human made. Have only existed for seconds. They're artificial, not appearing or naturally. Okay, that's what I thought. So they're just like. I see. Okay, yeah, that's kind of what I thought. And why do they have to give them such dog names? Mendel Levium. Is that just like? Yeah. I don't know. Some of them can only be created in particle accelerators and exist for a few microseconds? Dude, that basically doesn't exist then. <laughs> Ohio, yum. <clears throat> An 119th element is thought to exist but not on the list because it's physically not discovered. So they're only allowed to add it to the list if they know for sure that it's... been made. Okay, so that's, that's what I mean. I was wondering if they were just like making shit up and being like, yeah, uh, you know, Pogillium would happen if we mixed Plinkism and you know, then we would create nipple nickium. Yeah, no, they actually have to make it to go on there. It's good, good to know. Get him. You stuck there, buddy. Copium on stream. Combine gallium with a human body to create copium. Hmm. 
Don't suppose this guy could hit him. You think it can? Well, that's huge then. Oh my gosh. Sure. <laughs> the element Mandelivium is named after the creator of the layout of the current periodic table. I think it's gonna create a chain reaction chat. <laughs> cool, floor wipe. Very cool. So now I can kill you, we think. Yeah, nice. Oh yeah. There was a person who tried to fake an element once. Interesting. My god, you are so giga dead. Fakium confirmed not real? That's a heartbreaker. Is this Pokemon from Wish? Look. Uh, I've played one Pokemon game. And this is better than it, so. Which one? Red. I got a mud kip. Oh. Ruby? Rubies are red. <laughs> Sorry, buddy. Two whole packs. Was it 2D or 3D? It was 2D. Where's this last guy? Oh. Head is upside down. I smell the hair's blood on you. Bring it, dude. I got the unbeatable deck 9,000. When an empty space would be struck. Yeah, okay. Oh, skeleton. Yeah, the old man who counter kills you, yeah. I was just worried that the trap went off, like, ev every... No, I, I don't know what I was thinking. I was confused and worried that it was significantly worse than it was.
Unfortunate. More bones for this sarcophagus. We kind of pulled the wrong cards here. All right, we got two fives. Okay. Can block a scarcophagus. Or block the frog, I mean. But, you know, he moved out of the way and now we are frog full. Okay, guys. Thankfully, we do live another turn. But will it be enough? Maybe. Now we are cooking. Nice. This and this and bump him up twice. Huge. We have not been able to use this sarcophagus, sarcophagus at all. It really just has not, like, we just not, don't get bones. The one energy, like, two damage block is, like, the best card in the game. Leshy. Just throw it in something that can't attack. Yeah, I just don't get four bones that quickly. You had bested the unhinged prospector, the gormless anger, and the enigmatic trapper. You found yourself standing before your ultimate match, Leshy, scribe of beasts. Your ambition to replace Pog? Good. Though if you do not defeat me, you will not get that chance. Steal yourself, for my beasts will show you no mercy. Do not spare your creatures. My cameras are waiting to capture them at the moment of their demise. My leshy voice sounds like Palpatine. I was going for Palpatine. Thank you. Oh, interesting. Okay. So now we got... Bro. Before that one dies, I'll need to catch 
<laughs> nice stats. <laughs> oh, the Draugr's... Dude, the Draugr is not that insane. Okay. And finally, the Sigils. That will do. The deaths of your creatures will form a beautiful mosaic. <laughs> yeah, will it? Having... Shit cards wins the day again, chat. <laughs> Bro's cooking up the worst card of all time. Don't laugh yet, Smith? Okay. I won't laugh. Just stay away from that bomb, I guess. Curve hopper. This is just like a good card, yeah. Oh, oh they're mine! <laughs> oh, that's real unfortunate. I have been giving, given the absolutely dog shit cards. <laughs> okay. I mean, I'm still chilling. Get him, skeleton. The great scribe was incredible. Bested. Far away. Oh, far away, a light enveloped a long forgotten monument. Hell yeah. Triumph, narrowly avoiding tooth and claw, the scribe of beasts was defeated. That you were able to defeat Oh, that you able able to defeat me beggars belief. But now I must yield to you. My only regret is that our battles were so brief. Surely the summit of victory was made sweeter by our more arduous ascent. Not gonna lie, this has all been rather easy. Like, I even won when I had, like, a really bad deck. Like, when I've made my first deck, and it was worse than, like, my plain deck. Oh my god, he's here to get me. 
I had to see your face after you lost. You're just so... <laughs> Bad. Spig's wet sock. I am built like your wet sock. Welcome, first time chatter. It's no wonder we're back here again. I mean, it would have been even sooner if the disc wasn't lost. Take a long look at this face. <laughs> Because you'll never see it again. Oh my gosh. The whatever it was called. Card that I didn't like. I'm done being your pet, you stinking beast. Stout, that's his name. Well, I'm glad that we're killing the stout, because I've always hated him. I pushed it too far that last time. Why don't they see? To live as a beast would be the most noblest thing. Even so lowly a creature as a stout. Well, time to go kill the stout, I guess. Oops. It is time, challenger! Who's the scribe that you will replace? Stout, bro. Fuck that guy. Kick his ass. <laughs> Suckers. Oh. You actually picked me? Great. I can skip past the part where they whine at me. Let's get this over with. I got some big plays to make. You're supposed to battle the scribe that you picked, but like a powered up version for the finale. This is going to be different. Well, I'm glad you're not doing that weird rotate -y thing again. Because that was kind of... pathetic. I'll just leave this here. I've got to give it to that dredger. I'm not as useless as I thought. Okay, I guess we'll see what he does. We'll see what he does about this! <laughs> Shit. Ticket. Chat, my chunks are corrupting. Allow PO3 to gain control of inscription? Bruh, that was not my plan. I wanted to whoop his ass. <laughs> my face turned into 10 pixels. You done gawking? Can we start? You wanted to replace me. Look at us now. This is Botopia, a once great technology par technological paradise. It's ruled over by four uh, uber bots, that's right. And you've got to get out of there and beat them. Why? To go perform the great trash Of course. It doesn't matter what that means. You want it, okay? Get up. Yeah. You got transcending to do. I think sniper bot. But yeah, I'm going to call it quits right away. Yeah. Hell yeah. I mean. Here, here. 
Botopia used to be safe for travelers. Now rogue bots block all the major roads. Okay. Anyway, yeah, I am gonna. I oh, that's, I'm gonna. I'm gonna call it. I'm gonna call it for today. I will finish this. I didn't. I didn't know really what was gonna happen. Like people always talked about progressing in this game. I didn't really know what was gonna be. Yeah. Oh, longing web time. True. Now we're gonna play a bit of longing. It's <gasps> a good idea. <laughs> it says I have 18 hours in this game. Not quite. Gallium checkup on the can? Well. Yeah, nothing. I dreamt about endless... About endless hall with white pillars. So if you've never seen this before, chat, we are occasionally doing it at the end of streams. It's a game that takes 400 days to beat. We just spent three days waiting for that spider to build a net so that we could climb it. <laughs> Thank you, friend. Can't wait for a disappointment. True, I am kind of stoked for a disappointment. I'm not doing it with any speed-ups. No, not unless it's like in-game or something. Chat, we get a mushroom. I see two mushrooms. Mushroom. A mushroom. I will hand it with the handle it with the utmost care. <laughs> uh we can eat it. There's another one right here, so I guess we might as well. What a lovely fungal sprouting. mushroom it's glowing in the dark <laughs> so the game doesn't take 9,000 hours no it, it continues while you're not playing it. it just takes 400 days grow mushroom the perfect soil for mushrooms of all kinds so I guess we can take them back with us maybe Is this the whole game? No. There's so much more to it. So it alternates between eat mushroom and grow mushroom. And I can't pick up coal. Yeah, it's a light source. I mean, it's cool. I'll, I'll carry on to it for now, but... I want to be able to pick up coal. So I think I'll plant it. I'll plant it and remember this point. This game be a video i don't know maybe in a year a bit over a year we're still not at the last year of game play yet game's not free it's like ten dollars or something but uh, i don't know much about it i purposefully haven't spoiled much so there isn't a map that's kind of the thing i could not make it back to my house however I've remembered some spots that I that you can walk to. I think the idea is just that you learn. I don't know. 
Only five minutes until day 388. Yeah, that's because I started it on stream. So the beginning of a new day is often going to line up with the end of stream. I wonder if the green mushrooms taste just as good as the other ones. I bet they're even better. The longing is about waiting. <laughs> he did not like that mushroom. The longing is about waiting for 400 days. Keep eating it. <laughs> One more. Hold on. He's going to quit when he learns that he has to edit. Oh, Connor. <laughs> No, it'll be a it'll be a great you know a reflecting moment on the past year like today we held melted metal this wall seems fragile enough to break through if only I had my matok well okay I'll remember this spot this is the matok spot and let's head back also beat post head, that's true. Next year it'll be Mercury, yeah, next year Uranium. The concept of having to wait to play is interesting. It is, yeah. And, I, like, everything is slow. Like, the walking is slow. Progress is slow. It's all slow, and I like that games aren't usually that you know it's a game specifically made just to be slow yeah i know apparently you can buy uranium yeah uh, i uh, i don't plan on it I ever done a QA, like a question answer? Every single stream is a QA, if that's what you mean. 11 coals. We've just been trying to go up. As a general rule, we've been going up. So I will continue to attempt to do that. It's impossible to beat and refund the game. Yeah, you might be able to do some sort of system time's coming, but I don't... I'm getting further and further away from the king. Maybe it's time to head home and read a nice book? No, we're on a journey of a lifetime, bro. Presumably they're actual caves. I don't know. We are heading up. I'm gonna get my guy to see his son for the first time. Oh yeah, my the dude is my dude's just like a minion. Do I think it's possible to get to the surface? I have no idea what this game entails, besides waiting. Chat, 30 seconds until day 388. It's 400 days until you're supposed to wake up your master. This big king that rules over this area, supposedly. He gives me instruction. He says he has to rest for power. No, the metoc! No! And that's it. He just says, fuck around for 400 days. I'm surprised that there is no one other person streaming this game. Me too. Whenever I stream games, there's always thousands of other people streaming the game that I play. Happy day 388, chat. 
I bet this is gonna be Matt Talk Gaming as well. Probably good to head back home, yeah. Yeah. We need the Matok to get higher. So perhaps it's time to... Can you not run? 400 days, lest we forget. Hopefully, like, this walk is actually gonna take like half an hour, I'm, I'm not kidding. Um, hopefully the walk continues if I close the game, but like I, I, I think this is it for hour six now. Last hydration reminder of the stream nodders. Oh, I haven't gone this way yet. I want to go this way. Hold on. It's a mixed mushroom cave. Some of those mushrooms seem to have grown quite immense. Nah, yeah, matok. All right, we gotta go home. That's the first area that I remembered. We need to make sure we remember home so we can get back there once we do find our way back, if we can. <laughs> no, Mad Dog. But this walk is probably going to take about half an hour, so this will be all we accomplish today, I think. But yeah, I'm just gonna play like 15 minutes of this at the end of every stream. No mad talk. You know what, there's somebody I met at TwitchCon, actually, that I'm gonna raid. She's playing Bloodborne. She's on some sort of... long marathon stream. Uh... Miss Jackie CR. There was something that she helped make that I I forget. I don't know. There was something really cool about something that she... Anyway, we're going to raid her. <laughs> There's something cool about her. I don't remember what it was, but we met at TwitchCon. It was fun. A chat. Uh, next stream, I might actually be doing the the fire game with Daco and John. Chain together this one. Might be doing that with Daco and John. Either way, have a good night, chat. Sending you away. I'm gonna go make myself a bagel. Hang with loaf. <laughs> 